See if it works. Um, hopefully everything works good. We are in fact back outside. Uh, I, uh oh, you know, not right now. Come on. Um, hopefully everything is still working properly. I haven't really got to test anything and I am back in the trailer. So this is very much a testing stream. Very, very much a testing stream. I, uh, I'm already getting pretty fucking cold <laughs> because it's like going to be minus one tonight. I don't have warm socks on. I did not prepare for this. So we're going to do what we can. We'll see. It's super scuffed. Like my whole setup is super scuffed. Uh, I don't really even know what to say to you guys, but we're going to give it a go. Uh, no, Mac, nice to see you. We are back outdoors. <laughs> it's gonna be fucking cold. It's gonna be cold. I didn't expect it to get this cold today. It was, like, really, really nice out. Um, I'm, like, I need to, like, put a piece of plywood down so that it raises my chair up because right now I'm, like, sitting, like, way lower than what I can, like, I normally sit. And, like, my... You guys are over here on like a wobbly desk thing it's crazy it's crazy so we're, we're experimenting with how to improve this as we go uh i want to be able to read you like you guys's messages without like turning my head like 25 miles but it just might not be an option so yeah it is what it is nice to see you um I don't really have too much of a plan. I might just go into normals. I, I, I don't know if some of you may have watched last stream, but I'm really... I should burn through some of this gear, but I really don't like the whole creep thing that's going on. It's just so disadvantaged for me to actually try to PvP. Uh, I'm better off just like hiding in the corner and waiting for my moment. So it feels strange trying out new builds right now. We do need to quest. We do need to level up. Because I feel like it's around the corner, but this means we need to get a lot more kills. I would really love to get my armor up. Yeah, we need three more rogues and three more clerics. It's going to be tricky in uh, in goblin caves. Very, very tricky. I'm going to need an apple while everyone arrives. My beautiful background is like insulation that's half ripped out of the wall. Um, you think that'll remove creep? Yeah, I think they're going to make some serious adjustments to creep. I'm not sure what they do to, like, fix it, but it's so game-changing, it's crazy. It's it's crazy how game-changing it is. I don't know. I feel like they'll have to do something. They really will, right? Um, let's just see. I want to see, make sure everything's looking okay. I didn't really check too many things. Last night seemed like everyone was streaming. There's like fucking 16,000 people playing Dark and Darker. Pretty cool. Um, but yeah, once again tonight, like, I feel like more people are like committing to this wipe. Where at this point, during the last wipe, I felt like there's a lot of people that just weren't, um, were already out of the picture. Just ping your boy SDF, yeah. Yeah. This is very much a testing stream to see if I can even play. GG <laughs> Wilson had to take a red portal. Uh-oh. I got kicked out of my home, so... I have been kicked out. I'm gonna check. Uh, yeah, okay, everything's good. Nice. Wanna make sure my announcements and stuff are working properly. Excellent, okay. Uh, I think they have to change creep, though. I see Logic's new streaming position. Oh, man. Oh, yeah. We're in, like, we're in a bad situation, but a good and a bad sort of situation. Trailer Gaming. Yep. Look at this. It gets really spooky if I turn this light off. What do you think? How's this look? My mic is in like a really horrible spot. So I have to like reach under it to reach my keyboard. 
And this, for whatever reason, this table has, well, it has rounded edges because it's, like, meant to be something you squeeze by to sit on the sides. So, like, my mouse pad's, like, kind of flopping off the edge of my desk. And, uh, it, it's just, like, it's really not good. I need to, um, I think I need to put a piece of plywood down so that I can, I can, like, raise up my, um, my seat. And then maybe sit closer to the desk. Because right now I'm, like... What did I just hear? Something happened. Something just fell or whatnot. I don't know. Something hit the trailer maybe? I don't fucking know. I'm already a little scared. Okay, we're turning the light back on. I hate the dark. Mmm. Honestly. I would be almost shocked if there wasn't a mouse living in here. I thought for sure I was going to find it when I was, like, cleaning out some stuff to put my shit in. Also, like I told you guys, the sealer didn't work on the ceiling. So there's actually a Wendigo. There's actually, like, mold on the new boards, wood I put up, for the ceiling. So I had to clean it with Lysol. And uh, it's supposed to snow tomorrow. So chances are it's going to get wet again. There's a whole bunch of moisture trapped, so i got to rip all these panels off. Um, yeah. What happened was I just ran out of warm weather. So I put the sealer on, and it just didn't, um... It just didn't... It didn't set good enough. And then moisture got in it, and it just started lifting off the cracks. So I resealed the whole thing. The right side worked. Left side I did too late. And a bunch of the spots I sealed, there's still water getting in. So it's hitting the plastic and just running. And then, like, there's, like, giant wet spots and mold in the middle. And I, I had everything redone. So you know that's in the insulation. I need to basically rip the roof off again and let it dry out once it gets warm enough. Mm-hmm. So, yeah. Um, yeah. I'm not sure what to do. I, I just gotta grin and bear for now. Mm-hmm. Yep. Ricky got kicked out. I'm gonna help Bubbles fuck the neighborhood cats. Keep them safe. Getting a bag of cat food in the back corner. I think my mic's like in a weird spot, so I don't I hope it's not too loud. Honestly, I have no idea. Like, I didn't really know if this is gonna work. Everything feels super awkward. Like, I'm gonna be in a- I'm gonna be- I can't get any closer to my desk and it's driving me crazy. So, yeah. The lighting matches the dark and darker vibe. Kinda cozy. Now you look like you're in a horror shed. Oh yeah, it feels like a horror shed. Yep. I have been in minus 45 with a tiger torch and a frozen ass roof sealing it because other people shit the bed. Look. <sighs> yeah. All it takes is one little leak, right? And then it just, it just, I should have, I should have definitely put a tarp over my trailer. I just got lazy. Uh, I thought my work was going to be good enough and then I, obviously it wasn't. All the structural stuff I did is still good. I just need to basically air it out again, reseal everything when the weather's warm. I gotta take these panels off, but everything should be fine. I just have to, like, deal with the water issue. Oh, we're back. Nice to see you, Weasel. Some serious F-bombs? Oh, yeah, well, I can get a lot louder now. It's gonna be a weird transition, because, like, before I was just, like, trying to be... I would, I would screw up and get too loud, and then it'd get me in trouble. When do you think they release multi-classing? What do you guys think? It has to be, like, in the next... I want to say next, like... What the fuck is that? Oh, God. There's a mosquito infestation already. Fuck. Um... I would think it has to be within, like, ten days. Like, within ten days. It has to be, right? Are they going to make us wait that much longer? Which is why I need to get a class level 35, so I can at least experience it when they, um, announce it. My fighter's only level 28. 
And I didn't do much questing on him. And uh, I don't really intend on doing questing on every class. I just don't have time for that. My toes are getting cold, though. It's 10 degrees in here right now. Celsius. So about 50 degrees Fahrenheit. It's a little colder than I was expecting. But I, I realized the little heater I used to have in here, I took over to my parents. Oh, no. Elon. No, Elon. Elon. Not like this. Don't do it. Elon, please. Little bike machine. I'm just hoping, um... You, you're thinking three, a few weeks. Ah, oh, I can't... They said... What Didn't they say my mic's all fucked here? Didn't they say it was gonna be like the first month or two of wipe? Like, within the first couple weeks? I thought it was like a month. Tops. No, say the starlink? Like, I hope not. Yeah, I should put the thermometer back behind my head. Somewhere. Oh! This way you guys believe me. See? 10 degrees, baby. For everyone in the States, about 50. Yep. About 50 degrees in here. And I have no shoes on. So my fucking feet are already getting cold. I might have to place both my feet behind my PC. Keep them warm. But, uh, I just wanted to try things out tonight. It's such an awkward position to go from a really comfortable setup to, um, super scuffed. <laughs> We're back to super scuffed trailer gaming. It's crazy. Base broke the thermometer? What? What do you mean? Of Florida. It's 10 degrees Celsius. It's Celsius, see? Celsius. 10. The one up by the window is it's saying 8 degrees right now. Alright, we're gonna try to game like this. We'll see how it goes. Like I said, I'm not super... I'm not super enthralled with the whole creep changes. And the fact that we can just... We get punished... We're wanting to PvP right now. And by that I mean, like... <laughs> are you are you living in a van down by the river? Perhaps. Yes. May as well be. Honestly. Um, I'm not super thrilled with the whole... Anyone that's making noise and, like, doing PvP stuff just is at a huge disadvantage. I get it. You could probably train yourself to be, like... Um, more cautious. But I don't... I just don't enjoy... Trying on a new build and like trying to learn some PvP. Uh, yeah, like looting and stuff is difficult too. Mm hmm. Hmm. Hopefully, Starlink doesn't fuck around. I do have like a really long, I have like a hundred foot Ethernet cord uh, running to my house. So that's kind of unique. Uh, I don't really, I just want to go into normal, just fuck around for a bit, see if I can even like navigate. Navigate everything properly with the way the setup is. Um, I was experimenting a little with champion armor, so maybe we'll talk about that a bit first. I was trying to find a way to do more. Um, I had this weird idea in my head that we'd do more strength and maybe go back to like doing book because, like someone mentioned last night, <sighs> nothing you can do with surprise felling axe. Yeah, felling axe is like one you might be able to get away from. Surprise Zweihander with Achilles Strike is just impossible. Yeah. Or like Cleric. Cleric smite. A cleric Smash and then Judgment. Whatever. You name it. There's so many ways to. Like, that first hit advantage is just crazy. Um. So, yeah. I was doing some experimenting where I was like, man, wouldn't it be nice if Halberd was actually, like, somehow useful? I'm like, what if I forced them into melee with my book? Like I was doing when I first started doing this. And then I'm like, you know what? Let's use Spellbook instead of Crystal Sword. And... It's a fucking mosquito. Shit. 
God damn it, this is gonna be a problem. Yeah, so... But then I kinda got thinking too, I'm like, I'm probably never gonna land a halberd hit. If the second anyone sees me swap to that thing, it's just like... Oh. Uh, they're just gonna like, disappear. They're, ne they're never gonna get close to me. So, yeah. Bardish. Yeah, Bardish with block and stuff. Think about it with counterattack, multi-class. Bowing Axe with a kill strike is possible too. I just haven't really played this way. Got barred to 20 and built a really good kit and some backups. I just couldn't be bothered to play with some of the new changes. That's how I felt last night. Um, My child was kind of going crazy too. I don't think there's any way we can really use... Um, unfortunately, Halberd. I did, I did kind of buy a champion armor just to see what it would end up doing. And I don't think it's a bad option considering we get... We get more HP. I think one thing the build was lacking before is we had like 45 or 50 um, percent armor rating, but we had no HP. So, there is a fucking mosquito just tormenting me. Uh, so we had like no HP, which was awful. So even like a torch lantern hit would take me like down to like 60 percent of my HP. Uh, like 30 plus damage from a torch smite. Torch Lantern, yeah. I said Torch Lantern. I meant Torch Smite. Did you see Youth uh, Frost 60 Will Plate Lock build? Holy crap, that thing looks scary. Hmm. I did not. I saw Kaz was was running a build, but it was like full legend, like full purple gear. Um, and he had like like probably 50 some percent PDR, like 270 some movement speed. He had some really nice stats uh, accumulated. He, mostly, I think what was was making it possible was all the plus two all gear um and i don't know if i should keep this but I'm, I'm waiting for a day where it's useful maybe we get rid of this guy uh we need to fit this stuff in i'm just gonna mess around with normals and try some different things out for a bit i don't really want to commit to fuck we're gonna have no room silo 300 bits back into the trailer thank you um, I bought one of those Magnesium XL gaming mice. It's insane. Have to get used to lightweight, but the app where you control it is so good, and it's the fastest mouse latency-wise. Hmm. You just built, um, didn't you just get a whole new PC set up, too? So you're probably feeling, like, like, really good right now. Like everything, you, you're really feeling the gamer, gamer gear advantage. I tell you, when I went from, when I went from, like, uh, 60 hertz monitor to 144 and some of those things. I think we we might be able to sell that to something. I felt really good. And like got a different an actual mouse that was like decent quality and all these things. It starts to feel a lot different. <clears throat> Love the new setup camera. You look hot. Nice. Um, I'm allowed to read those things out now that my wife isn't right behind me. Wilson, you should consider using Marauder outfit. Yeah. I've I've thought about this as well. Yep. Yeah, I had a couple of them that were really going to work out kind of nice. Uh, they're giving me decent movement speed. It's actually really high armor rating. Hmm. Curse of Pain was hitting for over 40 damage with that guy's build. Jesus, 60 willpower, 40 damage. Jesus, I don't know what to get rid of here. Um, All this stuff I want to keep. Maybe we get rid of... Great Helms, but we're going to need those if we go back to actual plate lock. We could sell a couple spell books. Seems like a bad idea, but maybe we could. It sucks not having room for your, your stuff. It really does. Uh, let's do this. Cobalt Ore could probably just toss that as well, but we'll keep a hold of it for now. I thought spell books were like 150 each, but that may have changed. That may have changed. I'm not sure what this helmet's worth, but I'm going to guess, like, two true magical damage plus magical power. Let's just put 100G on it. And then... DM? Let's see. Ha 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 ha. Marauder outfit with a unique... A unique Marauder outfit. With seven agility. Jesus Christ. Yeah, that'd be nice. A magic damage bonus. Seven agility chest piece. Damn. What are these worth? 70? Sure. I should check what a spellbook's worth. 
I'm a little out of the loop now in spellbooks. I thought they were 150 easy, and then I think something like weird happened yesterday where they were selling like 50 gold. Oh yeah, okay. Is this a good one? That's maybe one we keep. And we sell this one. Yeah. That goes that goes back in the stash. Back in there. We sell this one for a hundred. For ninety-eight. Man, my, my keyboard's in such a weird spot. This is going to be so awkward. I want to try it tonight, though. I think there is a podcast tonight as well. It's tonight, Tuesday. For some reason, most of the day, I thought it was Wednesday, but the holiday had everything all screwed up, so... Okay. Here we go. Ah, uh, my feet are getting very cold. I might have to put my boots on. Pulled up from Pile last night. Wasn't the Red Green Show filmed in Canada? It was definitely a Canadian show. Speaking of Canadian shows, I started, for whatever reason, uh, have you guys ever heard, like, go 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 Have you guys ever heard that? That, like, little, for whatever reason, that gets stuck in my head. And here's why. I don't know, none of you will know this. Um, it's a really, really old Canadian show called The Great White North. It was, like, a little, like, two-minute poser show, um, where they said A a lot and drank beer. But that's the intro to that show, and for whatever reason, it's been stuck in my head for a week. I'll, I'll, I'll let you listen to it, the intro. Um, I don't want to get demonetized here on YouTube, you know. It's called The Great White North, Bob and Doug McKenzie. And uh, for whatever reason, I've been saying that all the time. And now my daughter is, like, starting to repeat it. So my wife's getting a little annoyed. Okay, Just... good day. Welcome to The Great White North. Go. Go again. Yeah. So, for whatever reason, that's stuck in my head. Um, I hope, hopefully you guys got to hear that, but it, it's, yeah. Not much of a show in the U.S.? No. No, it wasn't. Sing it again? No, thanks. <laughs> no, thanks. It's fucking stuck in my head already. Okay, I, I shouldn't, I can't really take my sleeves off, but we're just gonna have to try to figure out a way to make this work. I can't believe you haven't seen Letter Kenny. Yeah, I know. Um... Butter Kenny seems like a very, very Canadian show as well. Yeah. So, my daughter is very much like a mimic when it comes to a lot of these things we're doing, so. I gotta stop thinking that. Hmm, what do you guys think? What should, should we do the Chris? What should be our normals? Just like mess around, blow corruption setup. Do we want to try Bardiche just for fun? I was thinking of like having a backup option of like. Uh, blow corruption, or blow corruption Zweihander. Like, wouldn't that work? I have to turn my mic down a little, I think. A little high. I'm talking a little louder, too, because, um, you were the dude from, like, from Letterkenny, like, gonna post in the Discord? Okay. <laughs> Did you like apples? Hmm. Hmm. I thought about keeping Crystal Sword on just to get, like, have fun with it. But I don't know if it's possible. I don't want this stuff on, but, um, I don't know if it really makes sense to do this. I thought this would be kind of funny, though. Like, pull out. He's a farmer. I don't know how Wilson hasn't seen that shit. Well. Um. I don't know if this works. The magical damage, we're not going to get any magical damage on our spells, which kind of sucks. But, we will have a blow corruption as a Um, or we could do like Chris. We could do this in our main hand, right? And then switch to the old Zweihander to mix it up. What, do you, what are you guys' thoughts actually, like, on legitimately on Bardish, on any other class other than Barbarian? What, what do we, what are our, what is our feeling on Bardish? I, I want to love the weapon, but I hate the first swing. You need some serious dexterity to hit anybody with it. Second swing's okay, but they have to stick around for the second swing. Halberd... I mean... We could blow Corruption Halberd somebody. I am sort of addicted to shield, though. We could do this. See if we even get the opportunity to do that. Counterattack Bardi's fighter? Yeah. That could be interesting.
Spin off of the hockey player's shore, is he? Hmm. We'll try this. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, we'll try this. I'm gonna miss Crystal Sword, but I'm not gonna have any dexterity, so... I'm gonna feel really bad having it... ...in normals. Let's, um... Let's try the Halberd for a bit. Why not? Oh, something sold. Spell book, of course. I really don't know how I'm gonna be able to do this consistently, play like this, but... We're gonna try. Like, my mouse is in such a weird spot, I feel like I'm in such an awkward position. Like, my, my monitor is, like, super far away, but I have no real way of getting it any closer. I don't know. I'm gonna have to change some things, because... If, oh, yeah. Oh, God. Actually playing the game is gonna be a challenge. That's the problem. Just, just playing the game. A lot of damage. <laughs> I am making excuses. I'm still mad about last night. Hmm. Your boy Blin makes shield videos? Interesting. You'll need to be very light and build move speed, buddies. Yeah. Hmm. It's wild how fast you swing Bardish with shield mastery block. Hmm. Problem is, like, Bardish block's only good against certain weapons. So if I'm fighting against a Zwyhand or Barb, it's almost impossible to block with Bardish. Oh god, I feel slow as fuck. I also feel like I'm sitting in, like, a... Some sort of fucked up... Gaming... I don't know what this is. I'm... Feels a little awkward. Let's just put it that way. I don't know what what's gonna happen here, but like my arm is, I'm so low. I'm gonna have to put a piece of plywood down under my seat. I'm I'm legit so low to my my screen. It's it's like I have to like raise myself up. Crazy. The chair doesn't go high enough. I thought it would. I did not right-click there, either. But. Um... Some Timmy Warlock with a Bardiche. Like, oh god, this guy doesn't know what he's doing, yeah. Yeah. I mean... It sucks that, like, the blocking is just so hard to pull off on so many classes, so... Against certain weapons, like, it's... It's really impossible. Oh, this feels so weird. <laughs> oh my god. Whatever, we're here, my toes are freezing. It is what it is. We'll try to find somebody. Four spikes already took a guy out there. Gonna work, boys. Work as busy as. Actually, busy as fuck for once. Have a good stream. Have a good one, Logics. Hopefully, my mic and stuff sounds good. Turn it down a little. Um. Yeah, so. I need to wear better socks. New background? Yep. That's right. Because I'm fucking cold. He's got that thing. I'm never gonna hit him right with that. He's just got a million of those. <laughs> Jesus. Backstep windless crossbow. Oh, so gross. So gross. Honestly. 
kind of like what I was trying to do with Shield Slam. Only he actually has a way to reload. Was that a windlass or just a normal crossbow? Normal crossbow. So yeah. If he's doing crossbow master, he actually has a way to reload this in time. Whereas if I do that on fighter class, I'm reloading forever. Uh, so I think if I ever go back to shield slam, like crossbow, I'm going to have to, um, take just a normal crossbow so I can actually get, get it off a few times in the fight. This guy, yeah, okay. I already read that one. The line hit behind the ice in treasure horde room and ice cave is the best place to cheese the Wendigo. Yeah, there's a couple of ways I uncovered to cheese that man. Or cheese that thing, that beast. Wendigo is, um, he's in a trailer. Who wears shoes at home? Yeah, I'm fucking, my toes are frozen. Do I need to show you the temperature again? I actually want this guy to last a little while. Maybe we, we gotta torch these to death, don't we? Yes. Come here. Oh, that doesn't count. This works. Wait, I was gonna say, where's all my health going? It's working. Okay, there's some HP back. No more mobs. I have potions, but... Just arm it with Chris. I heard something. My arm is in such an awkward spot. Fuck, this is weird. And that fucking mosquito's back. What a bastard. I was watching Firebox do a little bit tonight of, um, Smite, Smite Cleric. And with all the additional magic damage he has stacked, he's like three-shotting people with torches. Like, hits them twice with melee and then just throws two torches at them and they die. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> like, that, that, it's so hard for me to do damage on fighter class. And Cleric can just press smite and throw torches. And do fucking endless magic damage. Bonkers to me. Uh, I just pulled Wendigo out of the room and shot it. Yeah, but you need it for a quest. Oh, I got him. There, I got the mosquito. Fuck yeah. Go on. I mean, I'll actually kill these guys so I can practice a bit of this bad boy. Can we loot this? There's a fighter. Very nice one to let me loot this. Um, show us your toes. Oh fuck. Distracted by the toe comment. Now I'll get the HP and we have to go back to work again. Getting it all back. Heard something over here. I have just been, um, spiders doing their spider stuff. That guy's probably gonna pull when I don't want him to. Come on. I know there's spiders here. I really don't want to fight that stupid little thing there, but I just want some HP quickly. There we go. Now they're coming. I'll defeat Cam when? Oh. I, I'm gonna have to put my shoes on. It's fucking cold. It's supposed to go down like minus one or something, but I remember being out here before when it was like 10 degrees or like 5 degrees. But that's. I, I sort of forgot that I had a little heater. At my feet then. Tonight I don't have the heater. I left it over at my parents' place, so... <sighs> Fuck. My, my foot on the right side of my PC is nice and warm. Well, kind of. Kind of warm. Other side? A little bit chilly. What is that one perk or skill you're hoping to get first when you multi-class multi comes out? Oh, that's a crazy question. Fuck, that's a crazy question. If I'm fighter rolling warlock, I would love just blow corruption. You know, that wouldn't be bad. I really wouldn't mind that. Come on, close enough, please. What? 
What what is that second swing? How does it go right through his body? Did he jump over it? I'm so confused by Halberd there. What was that? I did the side swing just to hit him with blow corruption. And he jumped over it. Somehow. Weird, blow corruption did like nothing either. Crazy. I should have done the overhead, I guess. I was like, oh, I'll just hit him twice with this and see what happens. Well, Corruption did absolutely nothing there. And I still can't believe that second swing missed. Alright, we need... F I don't think we need fighter kills in Goblin Caves, though. We need... We need Cleric and Rogue and Ranger. Something else. We're level 30 now. Um, which kind of is good. Maybe Halberd is not the play. But that that guy was like super Pepega too. I was just like, should be able to hit him with this. Apparently not. So yeah, one one perk or skill. If I'm fighter taking from Warlock, I feel like Shadow Touch is just like an amazing, amazing option on most fighter builds. <laughs> just like really nice. Uh, I don't know if this works with a bow. No, melee weapon, okay. So yeah, melee weapon only, but still, you can do like Slayer, do a wield, you do a whole bunch of shit. This works. Um, and then... And then it's anti-magic, I think. I think it's anti-magic. Dark Reflection's good. Um, and that's probably the three you'd want if you're gonna take something from Warlock that's a skill. And then... Or a perk, sorry. If you're going for skill, obviously Phantomize and Blow Corruption would fit right in nicely instead of Second Wind, I think. I really think Blow Corruption instead of Second Wind would be fine. Phantomize plus Sprint would also be very, very mobile. Um, you imagine a Slayer fighter with Phantomize. They can just charge at you, deal fucking infinite damage, and then press Phantomize and get out for free. You're never catching them with 10% move speed bonus. A lot of people will probably take Blow Corruption, but Animized Sprint Slayer Fighter has me kind of terrified. I have to have perfect spacing for Halberd, otherwise it's ineffective. Yeah, I suppose I probably did like a reduced damage hit there because I was in the Sour Spot, All right? Yeah, I don't know if the Halberd experience is going to be fun, but we'll try it. My hands are getting cold, too. I don't know. This is going to be a tough one. We're 38 minutes in, and I'm already fucking freezing. Not good. I need like a hot bowl of soup. A cold apple's not helping. For some reason I thought it'd be warmer. Smite or blow corruption on ranger and triple shot on bard? Hmm. Yeah, I feel like barbarian has a lot they can donate to other classes too. Like a lot. Um. Like so many of their perks are just like good. <laughs> you don't really need to do anything special for them to work well. Like robust, potion chugger. Um. I think there's another one too. That I wouldn't mind on fighter. But I didn't really want to level up a Barbarian. I wanted to try to get an option to do some spellcasting fighter. I thought originally I was going to do... Um, I really thought I was going to be doing more uh, wizard, but... It just takes so fucking long. I'd love to be able to do both. It's going to take a long time to have that be a possibility. Oops. That's not what I want to do. Can't hear a fuck all because of the pain, but hopefully no one pushes me. Fuck this thing. I need to like I'm in such a bad position. It's not even funny. I need to like sit up or do something. 
get active here because I need to get some blood flowing to my extremities. Maybe I need to do like a shot of whiskey or something. Grand Marnier. Certainly need to move my keyboard. Fuck. Alright. Full power, we'll take it. This is a good test stream. Walking mod cost behind such a behind such a time sink is a mistake. Yeah, I think it's somewhat intentional because they're not ready. But also I'm curious how long. Jesus. We just hit people with that instead. I'm curious how long uh like once they're ready to release it. I'm curious if they're going to make any changes so that everyone gets to experience it. Cuz if they like if let's say for example the game goes on epic and then people need to get to level 30 to experience multiclassing like this big new addition, it's going to be a rough one. It's going to be a bit of a rough one. Well, can you imagine how hard a Multiverse Wilson is going with that unique Marauder? Yeah. Multiverse Wilson is a sellout, though. Not cool. Alright. Find some people to kill. So anyway, we'll see. Zebra, we'll see what they end up doing. Like I said, I, I originally said I'm pretty sure this, it's this lengthy because they're not ready. I mean, some people are like level 70. Most people play the game like every day. And for long amounts of times. Man, he's having fun and his toes are warm? Probably. Yeah. Fuck. Yeah. Probably has a house and shit. Has room for, for what he wants to do with his life. Motion you check our Torture Mastery Warlock? There are so many possibilities. Yeah. What, what really scare, scares me is all the stuff that's already really good. Just getting a, like a, a really awesome bonus. Like, like I mean, like I said earlier, Slayer Fighter with Blow Corruption or um, Phantom Eyes is absolutely terrifying to me. Alright. Okay. Nice. Uh, they just do so much damage already. And then, yeah, once then watch them stack additional magic damage and just tear through even plate fighters. Just blow a corruption the shit out of plate fighters and run away. Nice. Animize is a really interesting skill that I think probably one of the more unique skills in the game. Can't wait for Slayer Dagger Rogue. Oh, that's a lot of damage too. Um. Our perks are good, but it seems like there are many... Yeah, they're mosquito, man. There is an infestation. Seems like there's better perks on Bard? Maybe, yeah. Hmm. Wait, did you say Bard? Let me see this again. Um... Better options. Okay, I see what you mean. Can't believe we died to that mage last night. Twist his little neck off. Hulk Rogan. Rondel Dagger. Wonder where he's creeping around. Hmm. Who knows? That's the spacing we need right there. PDR Poison Rogue. I saw a rogue in uh, Troubadour. And they had like 50% PDR. With like the new armor rating changes. It's a bit crazy. Please. Did I come in? No. It's crazy everyone get 50% PDR. Obviously he's sacrificing some other stuff likely. And spending quite a bit of time to put that together. But. It is a bit crazy. 20 armor rating on Marauder outfit and stuff. crazy. My block multi is boring and obvious, but I can't wait for a Slayer. Oh, okay. That's the... I saw a piece of that while I was fighting a mob. Oh god, just think of the advanced healer op position. Oh, okay, nice. Let me read this. Think of advanced healer. Ocean chugger? Hmm. Torture mastery? Oh god. 
It's gonna be disgusting what people have. I think advanced steel would be enough. Yeah. I don't know. At first, like it's like this week, I was like, man, creep isn't so bad. When I was kind of messing around doing questing, I was like, this is kind of nice. And then when I started to want to actually fight people, I'm like, okay, creep, creep isn't that much fun anymore in Goblin Caves. Forget I said, forget I ever thought that, because it just, it just changed the game way too much. Everything is so different. It's weird. I'm not sure what they, um... I think, like, SDF obviously is, like, something he really wants to experiment with, so they decide to try it. Also, you literally wouldn't be in Soapy's chat being like, what are your actual thoughts on Creep as a solo-only player? Um... He wouldn't be asking those questions if he if it wasn't something he was really interested in experimenting with. I'm wondering how long, though, it was, like, on the back burner. And they're like, you know what? Maybe we just throw this in now. Uh, this is gonna be maybe our last opportunity for a while. Curious by that. Oh, shit, I shouldn't have threw those off, actually. Crystal sword! Fuck it. Um... I need my one... Shit. One willpower. Excellent. We're back. We do no damage. 13-13. We literally do no damage. There. I think it fits the road class, but it's still pretty cheesy. Yeah, it just feels bad when... There we go. A lot of feels bad moments, I could say. As Ken probably says. Oh, wow. What a reach there, buddy. Stab him in the ankles. Get HD back. Oh, I thought I heard a guy. Will not save you from me. So dead. Shit. 50 armor rating and 50 magic resist. I wonder how close he was. Crystal sword wasn't the option there. Oh, one more hit might have done it, actually. Um, I think we just bloodstain and we win. Shit. I've killed so many people with creep and I just feel dirty. I happened to us last night. We, like, spent 40 minutes, half an hour, like, building a kit, getting it kind of where we wanted it, and then we were fighting a ranger for probably half the game, so we were getting kind of sidetracked, like, PvPing. We saw a little cleric, like, sneaking around. Not really sneaking around, but just on the other side of a door. We kind of left that whole area, and then I'm in, like, the trap room where there's, like, there's, like, pressure, those things pushing, and then the big pit with the centipede, and all I hear is smite right on my back, and then I get tapped and chase down with smite and die. I was running like 275 movement speed even with like no weapons or 280 maybe. With weapons, without weapons out, he was still catching me. He was like a fully kitted warlock, like purple everything. And it just sucks that I didn't get an opportunity to really like actually fight. It just felt bad, I was just like, well fuck. I just want to test out this build. And I'm kind of just being like forced into these awkward interactions. Where my best strategy is just to not don't pressure anyone, um, because someone will creep up on you and kill you. Just felt like I, I don't know. It felt awkward. Oh, fuck sakes! I felt like I'd done a lot right. It didn't take too many hits from the, the ranger. Did a bunch of things. Good thing he stopped because I was not ready for that. Oh, we're stuck on something. The wall. So yeah. 
Just felt awkward. Barbarian, we, we uh. What was that? Oh, spike trap. Hmm. Uh, nine out of ten, the juicer's gonna abuse creep better, yeah. The thing is, like, you literally just. The, the one thing with goblin caves is, too, like, you're not. You're not spending a lot of time really killing mobs unless you want to. You can. You can get through goblin caves very quickly once you have. Good gear. So, like, ice caverns, you don't have rooms like this where you can't see anybody. Or ice caves. You don't have those those rooms. So, in goblin caves, it just feels like really, really punishing to not be holding shift everywhere you go. God, what a shit weapon. It's actually such a shit weapon. <laughs> You're so slow the second you make contact. It's so bad. It's just like... <laughs> you might as well just put your hands up and call it a day. I couldn't even get... Like, I missed the second swing, obviously. He's like zigzagging, but... This guy knows what he's doing. That is why <laughs> you do Chris Dagger. And no one touches anything else. You can rotate around like a fool, and, um, take no movement speed penalty. I don't ever see a world where, like, I just, I really struggle to see where the halberd ever gets, like, they even made, like, two-handed weapons better recently, you know? Even if you take the movement speed penalty off it, the, the sour spot's so huge, and everyone just face hugs in this. Um, I don't know how you play my soul. Wilson Duos is so much more fun. Feels like a much better game to me. Yeah, a lot of people have said that. I do like the Duos map a lot better. Um, with Bloodstained Blaine has more weapon damage than Horseman's Axe, and Horseman's has minus 30 movement speed. Yeah, Horseman's Axe is garbage. Don't you like the Falchion? I do, yep. Uh, Falchion just feels a little slow, too. Like, once you, once you try out Chris Dagger with shield, even, and you're stabbing while moving at, like, still almost... Like, your max movement speed, you don't have those crazy, crazy slows being applied when you're swinging. Um, you realize how powerful, um, the Chris Dagger is. Even with shield, it's like, it draws instantly, there's no delay, and you do pretty decent damage. Yep. It's a bit strange, I don't know. They keep buffing daggers, and... Oh. One knowledge? I got strength and vigor here. What if I take the knowledge instead? Looks kind of cool, doesn't it? Alright. This is pretty much what you need to do now. Why is a lot of fun? Uh, wait. My games are 709 Warlocks? Yeah. Yep. Achilles on Ranger disgusting as well um yeah there's so many bad bad things out there skelly pete with leather cap i'm pretty sure he's on the podcast tonight i've got to try out the chris yeah the chris is it's absurd what i suggest is like just just experiment like with a base kit where you have a falchion and a chris i think he's on the podcast um and then, like, just just switch back and forth and see what happens. 
You know, it's absolutely absurd. Tuesday, Darkest Hour episode, yes. I don't think it's for another hour, maybe. Isn't it, it... Oh, isn't it... I don't know what time it starts. Hmm. Skelly feet, yeah. Alright, we'll go normals again. I'm probably gonna have to change something in here. Eventually. Um... If it's gonna be this cold tomorrow, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I think tomorrow I might, I might not be able to stream anyway, because... There's supposed to be a big snowstorm coming, but we'll see how bad it is. Starlink does not like weather. It's supposed to be a bit of snow tonight, even, even, which is what's probably happening to some of my shit. Um... Yeah. I never really thought about playing Zwei like that. Zweihander, like... Zweihander's disgusting. It's been, it's been so good for so long. They made it, I think they made it minus 40 movement speed at one time, didn't they? And they put it back up. It's just filthy how much damage you do. I'm moving, uh, and, and you still, like... I think what makes it so good, too, is, like, the, the reach is perfect. The swing speeds are, like, they're not slow. You don't, you don't, you don't feel like you have, like, a pattern where, um, there's, like, a swing that just, like, really griefs what you're trying to accomplish. It's, like... Oh, I hit Achilles Strike. Okay, I can probably connect with a Zweihander horizontal slash somehow. And then the follow-up swings are really nice. Like, you get one more horizontal, and then you finish them off with a big stab. Swing pattern seems really good on it. Um, maybe we do Fighter Zweihander, or um, Warlock Zweihander. Well, corruption's okay right now. It's only 15 magic damage. We have, like, none stacked, so... It's not doing huge amounts of damage. Not doing that much. Oops. Okay. My toes are fucking cold. I said I was gonna put my shoes back on, and I haven't yet. We would not have been able to rotate away from that if we were using the halberd. DPS is crazy. Um, spacing? Yeah. You get used to it. You will figure it out. Can't break this thing. Some mice will come warm up your toes soon. Oh, fuck. I wish I had my heater in here. We're holding steady at 10 degrees, but fuck does it feel cold. Okay, both you guys at once. All right. Things I will go to to stream dark and darker, honestly. Jesus Christ. Is there any other more committed streamers out there? I'm willing... I'm gonna have hypothermia. Chris let me down. The reach. This isn't good. Need some heals. I could have killed him there. I just didn't get close enough quick enough. I gotta hug. You said this before, I have to hug. And I didn't. Um, face hug. That's what you gotta do with Chris. I'm used to trying to space with, like, Crystal Sword or something, but not the proper method. We need some HP back. That arrow hurt. Whatever longbow he's using. Uh, I don't know what that is. Is that, like, armor pen or whatever? Fuck. I'll look over for a second. Hmm. I grab Health Shrine? Might have to. Come here. Um, the self of Glazer, who's that? Does it still feel like winter? Oh yeah, we're getting a big snowstorm tomorrow. 
Oh, right in the... Whatever that is. Right? Sound looking pretty nice out here in Montreal. Yeah. Look at those buns. Delish. Alright, let's go kill this ranger. Not nah, fuck it up this time. This him? Good job, Skelly. Get him, Spike Trap. Come on. Come on. he has over there that he's trying to lead me back to. Phew. Oh, that's it. That makes sense. Yes. I should have known. Huh. Something like pretty nice outside. Yeah, it's just like Old knights. I love traps. Yep. Traps and creep. Such fun, fun moments. Just one of those things where you just don't really care enough. You know, like you're not. You don't care enough to check every fucking corner, every little placement on the floor, like the whole dungeon for a trap and normals. But, if you don't check when you're fighting a ranger, that happens. It's like, oh, okay. My bad. I fucked up. Kicked out? Yep. I'm out in the trailer. You can use the training jump dummy as a health pack? I heard about this, yeah. Really interesting. I gotta put my shoes back on. It's fucking cold. I was walking around in the grass and it was muddy, so I didn't really want to have them up on anything, but holy fuck, my feet are freezing. Christ. Oh. Now my boots are cold. This is horrifying. Can you teach bossing? <laughs> Not really. Not really. I did... <laughs> Goblin, um... I did Cave Troll a while back on Slayer. And it's been a long time since I've done that. God damn it. I have to position my wheels in the perfect way, or else I can't get fucking close enough to my keyboard. <sighs> Why did you get kicked out? I bought too many, um, too many keyboards. Too many keyboards. My wife was getting fed up with it. But truthfully, I was just way too loud. And... It can be extremely aggravating when you're trying to get a child to bed. And someone is, like, yelling pivot. And gobble gussy at the top of their lungs. Yeah. I didn't really get kicked out. I just... I just decided to try to set up, um... To set up my... My trailer again. And at least try it. Like, this isn't gonna be an ideal situation, I don't think. Like, right now isn't feeling great. But, um, I want to try it. The only way to know if it's gonna work is to actually go out and stream, so... Um... Oh, fuck it. Go very slow. We need to kill some people, though. Maybe I should go Falchion. I'm always... Like, I'm so unfamiliar with this whole, like, hugging everything. Gameplay. Like, everything I've ever done has been, like, Falchion. Like, try to keep your spacing. Or, or like, you know, try not to get hit by their melee swings. But Chris Dagger's just, like... Do all your damage insanely quickly, and hope they die first. You want to be face-hugging and hope they miss. I'm trying to- I don't really hope they miss, but make them miss. <laughs> Different experience. Ergonomics are important. Uh, right now, I'm not feeling very ergonomic. Um, hmm. Could go... Try to find players. 
don't think we've killed anyone yet, have we? I don't know. My feet will hopefully get warmer. That will help the situation. And then I'll only be complaining about my hands. That's it. I promise. Nice. Might let me use Eldritch. Nice. I feel like I sh Hmm. Eldritch Shield's really good, but... I might have to switch to the old, um... Caster Warlock, Curse of Pains. I really hate not having a weapon with reach. I'm not gonna lie. Feels awkward for me. Right here. Goblin Mage just killed a guy. I wonder if he got forced in there or he just fucked up. I wonder if there's another guy there or not. Alright, interesting little dance. Hmm. Yeah, sorry, Chava. I'm not a, I'm not a bossing kind of guy. I probably should learn it. I really should. Um, but... I really don't know why I haven't. I just felt like bossing was a bit... A bit hard to do in, with the old 3x3. And they took, they took goblin caves away from us before, like, the map changed. Like, you know? They took it away from us in the downtime between wipe. So I couldn't even practice. Why does it not... I want to... I gotta... Like, that word, man. Logic says that word all the time, and I have to, like, allow it every stream. My thing only allows, like, words for a certain period of time, and it's annoying. Hmm. Three knowledge gloves. Crazy. Magic damage bonus vigor? Okay. Um. What are we doing here? Taking this? Are we putting this on? Let's see. Why not, eh? 387 move speed? Why not? Now we get spell predation. Let's have it on. Oh, knowledge? Yeah. Let's see if we find a ranger out right here. Did I just see a sh Oh! I did. Come here, you. Oh, you're fucking kidding me. Jesus. I clanged the wall. Do you see that? Here, guy out here, too. We need to kill a rogue, so that's good. We need rogue kills. My mic's in an awkward spot. I apologize. I seen that shimmer super last second. Very last second. Come on, peek me. I wonder if I can get away from him. He was wearing plate. Oh. Coming for you, buddy. God damn it. Let me catch this man. Don't fucking tell me. I'm gonna close the door behind us from now on. I think I just kill him. It must be low. We're just gonna go for it now. Fuck it. All these fucking open doors. God damn it. I wanna I wanna melt him to death. He's a sprinter. He's gonna go around again. You watch. Yep. Look at all the meds. 
He came prepared. Jesus. 36 damage falchion. Alright. He was trying to plate lock it like legitimately. Like he was really like he built a plate lock kit. Um who knives need to get nerfed? Uh, I th I've said this forever. They need to nerf the damage on like every all the throwables. Like Francisca's and um, throwing knife shouldn't get like 25 weapon damage. That scales with like, doesn't it? Does it scale with a whole bunch of other things as well? So, just a bit crazy. When you're fighting a rogue and they have like blue throwing knives, the fight can be over before you even, before they even have to switch knives. Dead guy here. Who is? Oh. Printers, man. He's going for extract, probably. I don't want him to get the escape. Nice. What? I thought he knew I was there. He didn't, apparently. Come on. I hear somebody else. I thought I heard another guy. Oh, I did. Oh, this is not good. Right, buddy, I'm bringing them to you. Is that a ranger? No. No. That was a big F for sure. Uh. Watch the def cam. Everyone get ready for the Discord things? Yeah. Watch the def cam. This is what happened to me. Oh no. I thought I had him too. I was like screaming like, why can't I swing? <sighs> Fuck's sakes. Elon, I don't- I, I This guy thought I was over there, you know? Oh, I want to leave. Fuck. Nothing I could do there. Oh, man. The nice thing about, like, the nice little, like, the one little, like, nice thing that's, like, funny. Whenever that happens in my stream, for whatever reason, it doubles my viewers for, like, a few, like, for, like, a minute. It, like, says I have double the viewers. Um, so it's a little, like, oh, that's kind of nice. And then I'm like, oh, fuck, yeah, we just lost, like, over half of those, though. <laughs> Everyone just disappears once big Fs happen sometimes. Whatever. Shit happens. My hands are still cold. Can confirm. Mr. Yammy. Is this like a Yammy alt account? Wasn't it- isn't it Y4MI or something though? I see my, like, uh, internet's being real dog shit. Multiverse Wilson just lost that. Rod Roper with the death. Serve the sellout right, yep. Is he still complaining? Wilson, are you in the trailer right now? Yes. It's fucking freezing. Look at this shit. I'll show you. I usually have a heater, but I left the heater over at my parents' place and I wanted to try- not the- no, real Yammy? Yeah, you're the real one. This is what we're working with. A little chilly. Let's see, what the fuck? I think that's like being like generous too, because the one up top saying like seven or eight. Multiverse Wilson's good friends with Elon. I fucking wish. 
Elon would like direct beam my internet. His internet is working. It's going up a little. Yep. A little. Very, very small amount. Um, like I said, if I had that little heater in here, I'd be fine. Fuck. I'm just gonna grab stacks. I didn't really want to fight all this shit. I wanted to fight people. You feel so quick with this damn thing. It's crazy. It's not even feel fair how quick you are with this shield and dagger. Like, this is as much movement speed you're, as you'll get off of the same movement speed as a falchion. Like, alone. You know? It's goddamn spiders. Craziness. Alright. Nah, in the universe, Starship already put up the big satellites in orbit and Starlink is perfect. Okay. Yeah, I had to disconnect my other service provider entirely. Since I switched this head here. So there's no backup plan anymore. It's just, this is it. This is it now. I'm stuck out here for all eternity. What's he going for? Okay, I'm fucking going. Could be a spawn over here, so maybe. Maybe we'll get to fight a guy. There's a health shrine in here. I have bad luck with these things getting through the door, though. I guess that's all I needed for heals. Creep. I hear him. Poor man. Come on. Fucking little rangers, dude. Oh, I almost hit my head. Hot. I need ranger kills. Thank god. Hug his face. He tried hard though. At least we didn't DC that fight. Nice. I also came prepared. Holy. Oh. Oh no. He's doing the mining thing too. We just killed him. We could mine. I mean, we have that. I hate when it does that. Bugs up my inventory, I can't pick up shit. Might as well, honestly. He's, he was gonna make a fuck ton of gold off copper. We just ruined it. I think he killed another man down here too, didn't he? Maybe this guy was the one that was prepared. Alright. Um, now we find the copper ore. Nice, right here. Someone's gonna creep up on us though. Um, let's see. I think there's a pretty good chance of them putting shit in next starship for Starlink. Yeah. I don't know if it's going to improve my situation in rural, rural Canada, but maybe. It's probably more meant for other places with more rich people. Um, I like to like run, I missed some messages over on YouTube. Xylophone. I like to run a long sword along with Chris. Yeah. Not a bad option either. You get only minus 30 movement speed penalty. Green screen are just not the trailer. This is the trailer, but we're facing a different direction now. So, I had to actually cover up the back window because it's... I didn't want you guys seeing anything. Um, yeah, we're facing like... This is like... The trailer runs this way, where before I was sitting like on the wall facing the windows. Now I'm sitting like at the end of the table because uh, I can't fit my chair anywhere else and I, I really don't want to put my back through what I went through before where I was sitting in a a chair propped up 
uh, from cushions from like the hardware store. Uh, it wasn't the ideal situation in my back. This feels a little better. Uh, I just can't get close enough to the desk for it to feel like super comfortable, so I might have to build some things differently. I seriously might just like tomorrow. I think I have some leftover um, press board or plywood, whatever you guys call it. Put that on the floor, put my chair on it, so I'm sitting up higher, and then I can actually get closer to my desk. Yeah. I've complained enough, okay? I'm complaining too much. Um, multiverse... Yeah, okay, we already, we already discussed multiverse, Wilson. I didn't miss that one. I think we take the... Any other... We're dropping so many frames tonight, I apologize, but tonight was meant to be like a test for um, how comfortable I'd be over an extended period of time in this. And I uh, wasn't really too concerned with everything else, honestly. Last night, Starlink was perfect. This has its days. Is this cobalt? Yeah. I don't think there's any more ruby silver or, co or copper, is there? It'd be over there. I, don't, I didn't think I saw any. I think it was iron ore. Isn't iron like one of the most useless things in the game right now? What's anyone using it for? Um. Hmm. Take this copper and run, or or we go fight another player. Hmm. Ranger dude killed a guy. I killed ranger dude. There's got to be some people left in here. Has to be. There's no way. There's nice there's nice little mosquito flying around again. Holy distractions. I have YouTube chat, I have Twitch chat, I have mosquitoes. Hmm. Gotta be somebody left. Sounds painful, it's not really painful, it's just it's just awkward. I definitely went through much worse last time I streamed out here. It was, it was, it felt awful then. Not so bad right now. I think it's just the temperatures that are fucking me. I need the heater back from my parents. I don't hear anything. It's weird clearing that many modules and not hearing anything. To get used to the old 3x3. Three three. Hmm. Oh, I missed the twist. Alright. You need to level up, so I might as well just be killing everything. Hunting trap killed a guy. Nice. Feels good, man. That happened to us the last game. No, last game was the DC. This game. Game before that was the ranger trap, I think. With the old twist. We get some strange looking potions. Maybe there's gonna be poison like added to the game. You can apply to your weapon. Like um uh the Witcher, like oils and stuff. What do you guys think of that one? Imagine if you could apply stuff directly to your weapon. Okay, great. Bastard trying to sneak around behind me. Hmm. Still nothing. Odd. How many people spawned into this map? I heard something up here. Oh. Alright. Feels so empty sometimes. Okay. This is a bastard. Alright, buddy. What's saying? I always forget. What's saying doesn't use my stacks, does it? I don't think so. I think we figured this out before. I've already forgotten. It was a long fucking day. Learning and talking and learning and talking. Conference calls, meetings, uh Three stacks of this shit? I'm gonna pull them over here. Hopefully no spiders come out. 
Jesus, that hurt. If somebody meds, we can afford to drink a couple. Thankfully, that guy donated some to us. Free physical healing. Nice. This what I want to find. I'll keep the fancy bandage for later. Yeah, hopefully Elon has figured his shit out. I don't want to have to deal with that again. There's gotta be some players around, though. Like, seriously. Oh. Let's see, two players. We're having a range duel. Going under. Okay. I need ranger kills, buddy. I'm sorry. He must be mine. Twist him. Stab him. Jesus. Yeah, we need ranger kills. There's another one. I want to go kill this other ranger now. Yeah, just W key with the Chris. It's an effective method. I try to space too much, and it's it's not worth it. All right. One same would help there, but I love Death Ray. I always try Death Ray. Wow. Doesn't ever seem to work out great for me, but let's take these ones. Sure. Wonder where Ranger Man went. Probably has like five traps on this door. Already. There it is. Yeah. Come on, die. I need ranger kills. Thank you. Nice. I thought that was blue. I gotta love just walking into someone with a Chris Dagger. And they can't do anything about it. Uh, I guess we take meds. I don't know. Save me from buying more later. Uh, Armoring Sword. The green Armoring Sword. What a green Armoring Sword sell? Take this, I guess. Better need a Ranger Kills, and here we have it. Poor man. Uh, the trap was a little bit telegraphed, though. Kind of... Place that when I could hear him placing it. <laughs> so... I was like, okay, I'll just sidestep around it. Very difficult. Where'd that go? Wouldn't mind getting out of here. What was it? Underneath? Nice. Okay. Another centipede before I go. Open this. Watch me accidentally step into it. Probably shouldn't open that. Someone might steal it. Would not put it past the sneaky little road. not. Okay, we're taking some damage here, mainly because of zone. Oh, we have three stacks. What the fuck? Ow. I was not in the poison at all. Jesus, buddy. We're good. Stop blowing all the rangers? Yeah, I know. Where did they all come from all of a sudden? Your mom's a hoe. Your mom's hoe. Oh. Got that wrong. A fighter player and a warlock. This guy's sprinting somewhere. He looks a little panicked. I don't know why he's using double axe when he has this option available. This one's sneaking around the outskirts. Looting up everything he can in normals. 
Found some blues. Hmm. He spit on you like three times, dork. Oh, I thought I was standing in that shit. All right. Once again, streamer is wrong. Uh, okay. Wonder how much experience we got there. I think I need these jugs, don't I? Request. I keep forgetting. Ah. I also need ancient scrolls, I keep forgetting. Damn. I guess I didn't really pay attention to him spitting on me. That makes a lot more sense. I believe you. I think you were correct this one time. Do I have physical power? Something tells me those might actually be worth money. Rawhide gloves are decently expensive, too. Amazing gr certain green items are actually worth... Worth something, at least, right? That's not. We got some ore. I wish I had five ore to make it an even number, but... Um... Copper ore. Copper ore to go up or down? 58, it went way down. Wow. Alright. So how much is 4 worth? 250? Say like... 225 or something, I guess? It was like 90 gold each. Crazy. Um, and then we'll check green. So I'm actually very curious what green loose trousers are with 5 physical power. Any guesses? I'm gonna say like 70 gold. I'm gonna say like 70 gold, but I guess like 150 gold. Let's say 135. Copper ore sold immediately. A little bit crazy. So is everyone just buying copper for the quest? Is that is that the whole idea right now that's happening? Because I've never really. I guess I I bought um. Yes, I did have to buy copper as well. No, how did I do it? I did the tailor quest. I bought the pants and bought... I think I bought powder. I need to kill three bards now. I don't think we've seen a bard all night. Most of them with a green screen? Only one time? Yeah. I'm literally trying to warm my hands up here. <laughs> warm! It's got to be getting colder in here. This thing says it's getting warmer, but I don't- I don't fucking believe it. I don't believe it. I wish I had my heater so badly. Fuck me. Armor, what do we need for armor? Yo, rogues. Okay, clerics and rogues. What do you think's easier to find? Clerics and rogues, or rangers and bards? I feel like bards are very difficult to find right now. I don't understand. Bard's a really good class, too. Maybe people just hate playing Bard in solos. I suppose that makes... makes decent sense. Bard in solos can be kind of bad. Just, like, frustrating in normals, maybe? I don't know. Maybe they want to build some gear before touching the class. Um... Hmm. Not sure. What else we got? We could gamble. I haven't really been doing any goblin gambling. Have you guys been doing goblin gambling? Bard needs stats to make it strong, yeah. Maybe normal's bard is just not a good time. I haven't done, like, any of this. There's just not, not enough options for me. I want to be able to, like, gamble on, like, reinforced gloves, maybe. I don't check it as often as I used to either, I suppose. And, like, a green ring of quickness? Like, what are we talking here? Like, what's the worst we can get here? Uh, what are worth? 65? Okay. Wow, the cheapest one, 65? I feel like we have a potential here. We're gonna gamble on that one. Alright. I thought they'd be, I thought they'd be way less. I thought they'd be, like, 30 or 40 gold. Alright. Prediction time. Is this going to be a W? We'll debate what a W is after the fact, but for now, um, 
We'll just go WRL. Maybe we'll be go based on market price. And I'm going to give you a minute since Ember's here. Wait. Prediction? Oh, nice. It looks different now. It actually shows me the timer. It actually shows me the timer. You want to be in a rate the dick, though, so I apologize. Not much I can do about it. What do we got? 40 seconds left. Holy shit. I don't know. I haven't gambled at all this wipe. So I'm really not sure if they, like... Do you think they, like, adjust the odds? Keeps trying to autofocus rather than keeping it set on manual, for fuck's sakes. It's probably because I'm moving around and the lighting is all fucked up. This smoked my mic, too. Um. Oh, yeah, is it... Huh. Interesting. I should be okay. Wait a second. Why is that? Why did my camera feel like it's in a different spot? There we go. Something weird happened here. Ryan. Ryan, six days a week. Thank you so much, man. We're literally freezing our ass off. We are back in the trailer hopefully your stream was good i i kind of forgot about one important thing uh when i moved back out here though i forgot um i forgot my little heater and so it's very fucking cold right now what are we sitting at yeah a bit chilly um so my my hands are freezing. <laughs> I'm not even kidding. I've complained about it enough. My chat is telling me um, I'm a complainer. PC is running fucking perfectly. Yes, you are correct. I see you, Ryan. Back in the Doinkmobile. Yeah, we have like a really a much different setup. My camera's being all fucky too because I have it on autofocus and it's not used to this lighting. Um, so I. Uh, I moved back out here, but I'm not in the same seating position because I wanted to use, like, my, my gaming chair. And turns out, like, the desk is just, like, really fucking high up, like, the table. So everything's just, like, really awkward right now. So I wanted to try it out tonight uh, and just see if I could be comfortable out here. You're a snow Mexican? I don't think I've ever heard that expression. Now king of YouTube content since Wilson decides to hate us. Look, I make YouTube content, just not as much. I spend so much time on this damn live stream. Buy a new keyboard, that'll fix it. Yeah, nice to see you guys. Nice to see you, Sir Thick Pipe. Welcome, everybody. Hopefully, um, your stream over there was good. Hopefully you get to play some marbles, which is my favorite part of Ryan's stream. Uh, we were gonna- we did a prediction to see if this is a W or else. I might finish that. Hmm. We also have Elon, who's kind of fucking us tonight. Yep. So, oh. tech guy, that is what you're experiencing. Tonight's tonight's extremely scuffed. And if you're not like a viewer of my stream, um, every night is just like a little bit scuffed, but tonight is like super scuffed. Yeah. Yep. I don't make as much YouTube as I would like. No. Uh, it's really hard. Really hard to find good content, and when you're streaming most times when you would be making videos, it's, um, pretty time-consuming. I Maybe I do the Ryan approach where, like, I do more days off, but it's busy, man. It's busy. Life. You're related to the late Norm MacDonald. Isn't Norm, uh, isn't he that comedian guy? Like a hilarious, hilarious comedian guy. Fuck, he's funny. Wasn't he on, like, The View? And he's like, well, it'd be better than the last president. He killed a guy. And they're all like, what? Like, yeah. He killed somebody, didn't he? Someone said that. And it's just like, what? <laughs> he just fucking blew everyone's mind. He's on, like, a guest, guest... He's a guest on some, like, really popular show, and he's just talking about how he, he thought the president killed somebody. Crazy. 
You know, in Ice Caves, there's a module where you can poke your head through the ceiling. When you do, you can see the peak of Frost Mountain and the word North floating up ahead. It doubles as a map select graphic. Interesting. That is weird. Hmm. He always did crazy shit on late night. Yeah, Norm's crazy. I wish I could remember some of his, like, real role. I just... You always get a laugh watching some of his stuff. Oh, yeah. Yeah, the other one I always remember is when he asked, like, the NBA player. Um, uh, how do you feel about winning this, winning the Rookie of the Year trophy? And, uh, why do you think that no one ever wins it? Uh, for, like, everyone always loses this trophy after their first year. Like, why can't people win it twice? Kind of thing. It's, uh, it's just, like, the way he worded it. And just the, the fact that, yeah. He's a clever individual. I just like the way he talks. He sounds very sincere and like kind of like like you're not sure whether to trust him or not at the same time. So it's like it's like a weird mix. It's like, okay. And he pulls out some really random stuff. Yeah, Katie discovered it. Interesting. I don't know what's going on with my stream camera. Like I said, tonight's um Sounds like you, bro. Hmm. Rip to one of the best, yeah. Guys, side note, how wide is normal's loot lately? I'm in a centaur tail. I'm up a centaur tail, golden key, and legendary bangles. In normals? Like crypts? I I do think normal loot is really, really good. Goblin Caves doesn't feel that amazing, but when I was playing Howling Crypts, uh, you can find a lot of blue treasure and purple treasure if you loot the lion's heads and stuff. Uh, I killed a killed a rogue in there, and it was just like. He was just looting, hitting all the hotspots, and he had, like, a full inventory of purple items. And I was like, holy fuck, this is, like, something you'd find well, during the old, like, HR grind. Just to find collectibles to sell for your, um, for your rank-up stuff. Time, time to change careers and be a comedian? Uh. That stuff. That's not an easy one. I don't think, like, it's, like, comedy can be somewhat, like, you can kind of learn... But, like, why do I feel like comedy is, like, one of those things where it's, like, you're either funny or you're not. And a lot of people view humor differently. Like, what they find is funny is different. So, you could be funny and, like, what's that, what's that girl's name that is supposed to be funny, but she's not funny? Amy something? Um, Aubrey? Maybe it's Aubrey. I think she streams on Twitch, too. The uglier are, the funnier you better be. Jesus. Amy Schumer, that's it. Yes. Yeah. There's probably women out there that find her funny, but I don't know why. Amy Schumer, yeah. Everyone on YouTube chimed in, too. Okay. You guys all know her. Yeah. You guys all know exactly who I'm talking about. Shots fired? Yeah, Aubrey. Aubrey's on the shit list because... I ended my stream, and I was watching her, and I said I'd watch until she died. And then she never fucking died for, like, half an hour. I ended up having to leave before she died. She was 1 HP to a bunch of mobs in HR, too, solo. Not HR, but Crips. She should have died many times. Aubrey Plaza is actually funny, yeah, she's, she's funny. Parks and Recreation, just in general, is hilarious. Some really interesting characters. Good old Ron Swanson. Fuck, he's funny. <laughs> Aubrey the dad streamer is funny, though. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know. You are saying some pretty nasty things about me yesterday. Similar to the type of stuff I get from Ryan. In my DMs. He sends me, like, bogus PC builds. He tries to trick me into believing that he's sending me stuff that's like, uh, what did he say last time? Oh, this has been data mined. You gotta see it. And it's some weird little elf image. Like, I think what you guys would call it is like weeb shit. That's what I get. Like, alright, thanks. 
Thanks for wasting my time. How come I don't hear anybody, man? It's so quiet in here. Norm McDonald, Bill Burr, George Cullen. Richard Pryor of the Greats. Wesley Nielsen. Come on now. We talked about him last night. Some somehow he came up after talking about beavers. Um the Naked Gun. And those shows, man, so funny. Oh fuck, it's funny. The humor is just so good. It's like middle of a gunfight. Picks up like picks up a, a quarter off the ground. Continues shooting aimlessly at people. Uh, good old Leslie Nielsen. That's Katie anti rogue propaganda. She's one shot a base kit. We're walking full. Wait a second. Multi. Uh, this is probably a conver conversation from a long time ago. I think over on YouTube. Oh, I'm bad at the game. Warlock. Oh. What do you- who would have thought a warlock duel? Happening in these caves. Fuck me, I'm down. Did not want to take that hit there. Hard to find bards. Please don't catch on fire. That was done with me. Fuck this idea. Where is he? My hands are cold. the wall. Ow. No, I want to go this way. I wish I had Eldritch Shield right now. I hope that's doing damage to him, but I don't think it is. Something tells me he's more alive than he should be. Come here. Ooh, that's not good. Fucking fuck. I'm like sliding away from my desk. My chair is like sliding away as I'm trying to play. Look how healthy he is. Jesus. <laughs> Ray of Darkness was doing zero. Oh no. Ray of Darkness was doing zero. What's- you have anti-magic on? It doesn't even. Fuck. We- I think the only way you use anti-magic is um- Okay, fuck it. Jesus. Nowhere's to put my feet. GG Wilson, fuck you, Zeplor. Fuck you. <laughs> I don't know what you take. I'm like death raying the shit out of like nothing is happening. You're half HP. Like I should have just been doing dark bolts. It looked like it was, yeah. I think it might have been tickling him a little bit. It'd be interesting to see. I've never got to witness a dark bolt or dark ray of darkness like damage. Goddamn Zephyr. What an interesting speedy little man. See it's crazy because also Bo Scuttle, thank you for that fall. Not as easy when it's not a fighter, huh Wilson? Look, I've killed other people with it. 
just primarily, yes, fighters are a little easier, especially if they're wearing plate. Um, so, so a lot of people, I think it's really smart what Zephyr is doing, like not wearing any gear. Like, there's probably, I'm getting like no value for having this on. Like, one knowledge is not, is not helping me any. And if, if we just did this, we're at 5%, like, none of this stuff's really helping me much. But here's why I do this, just so you guys understand. I put this on because when I do my plate fighter builds, or when I do, like, my crystal sword fighter build, I want to be moving at the same movement speed I would be when I'm fully kitted. And I'm usually around, like, 274, 270, like, 280. Like, we could probably put different boots on and, like, uh, white foot boots on. Change this, maybe. Different chest piece. Wouldn't be a bad idea. Uh, go back to what we had. But this was kind of, like, I, I set the squire up this way just so that I could, like, actually see how horrible the movement speed was going to feel. And, uh, I just, like, tried to say something while coughing is weird. Um, so, yeah. Truthfully, don't do this. I, w I would probably not recommend using much of the Squire gear unless it's like... Unless it's really giving you... Like, one knowledge isn't isn't even getting me enough for my second spell. Or my third spell. Fourth spell. It's kind of a waste of time. Unless I get something else. Like, I really want to get... Um, I need to start... I need to... I need to get this done. And then I get, I think, an upgraded Crystal Ball. Um... So, right now, what do we have for poor gear? Yeah. Hmm. We might just take the chest piece off and put uh, leather leggings on. Because... It might be a better idea. Leather leggings give you the best armor rating for the lowest movement speed penalty. Not leather leggings, sorry. Leather chouses. Or chos... Chous... I don't know how you say them. And this. But this is gonna, like, make my movement speed a little bit... Absurd. And I do want to practice with the gear I intend on using, so... Uh, yeah. I think that's gonna make me too fast. We could go, like, a really heavy helmet, just for laughs. Uh, slow ourselves down a bit. Mmm, 36 armor top helm, sure. Look pretty badass. We'll see what kind of movements we can get from this. Might be a good way to do it. 284, it's a little higher, but I guess we try this. That would be, like, ideally what we want to get to. I'm just back to my landmine knife slayer. Wow. Even better now because creep. That's disgusting. Wait till they get blow corruption or phantomized, too. Terrifying. What am I looking for here? I think this is good. Um. I do wish I had a bit of reach in that fight. Not going to lie. Trying to chase him around with Chris Dagger was a little bit painful. We, we did experiment with Halberd briefly, and it's a no. No fucking way. No way. If the gear isn't giving you any bonuses, it's useless? Yeah, but... It's true, but I want to try, like... You know what I mean? I want to get used to how it feels to be that slow. Understand? Maybe something like this. Be more logical. So, this is why we do this. I wish I had more, like... Uh, we're never gonna get the armor upgraded, are we? Not at this rate. A pocket Zweihander? I could go back... I have a decent book. I might go back to this and see how it feels for a bit. Um... I really like Chris Dagger, but... Maybe go back to, like... Try something different. Just to experiment a little tonight while we're in normals. Just see how slow and how long it takes to get our Zwyander out after using Bloodstain and whatnot. I feel like the second people hear Bloodstain, they just, like, evacuate the area. Like, no one sticks around for that shit. Hmm. I'm playing some wacky shit right now. Zwy Fighter dex build with Adrenaline Rush and Sprint, yeah. You can do a lot of damage, and that's some crazy action speed. We'll try this. I've been inspired by Zephyr. Did I equip it? I didn't equip it, did I? I see you, Vivac City. Things are good. We're back in the trailer. Oh, fuck. Whatever. Do this. We are back in the trailer. It's a little cold tonight. 
No one believes me when I say this, but it is actually only... Well, we're, we've gone up a degree. It's like 40... It's like 50 degrees Fahrenheit. 11 degrees Celsius. Nice to see you. Longsword? Yeah, longsword would be good. I just know the second I equip a longsword, uh, I'm gonna get, like, a whole host of people telling, telling me that I don't use it properly. So, I'm kind of scared to touch that weapon. I feel like there's, like, a, like, a, this, there's, like, a higher knowledge. It's, it's like, <laughs> there's, like, the, a mob of people that want you to learn every parry perfectly. Um, and I just don't have time for that. Just left click. That would be my method. And I don't know if people would approve of my methods. That's all I'm saying. How fucking dark? Can you guys even see me in here? Oh yeah, wow. It's kind of nice. It's kind of cozy in here. Um, alright, we feel so much faster. Snow Mexican? I don't know. Where did, where did you guys hear that? Is that like an American expression? Because I've never heard that. Hmm. In the shed or barn? Yeah. I do have a barn, and I, honestly, I was tempted to set up um, my stream down there because I, I, it's all solar powered, though. I wired all the solar panels and stuff up last year. So it runs all my electric fences to keep the deer out of my shit. Um, and I'm not, I don't think I have the battery. I don't have enough- I don't have enough batteries right now. Um, I, my battery bank is, like, old and aging and depleting. And I don't have enough to run, like, a PC and stuff down there. But if I- if I did the whole, like, roaming, um, Starlink, I could easily stream from down there. I'd literally be in the barn. Pretty crazy. America only recognizes two countries, America and the United States, yeah. Yeah. True. Everything else is just like some silly land that doesn't exist. <laughs> One of the lowest IQ rates in the world, yeah. Freedom, man. That's what freedom does to you. It makes you oblivious. Mm hmm. What other countries matter, to be honest? Uh, I know, that's. It's a very American thing to say. <laughs> American United States and Russia? Hmm. I suppose. New Zealand. Yeah. I don't think too many people are really too concerned with what New Zealand's getting up to. Logics. I hate to say it. But how many times a day do you think, like... Anyone in the West is just like, damn, you know what? New Zealand's just like fucking going hard. Or, you know what? New Zealand's doing some crazy shit. We need to worry about them fuckers. It's just like, you know? What are you guys up to, anyway? What do you guys get up to? <laughs> What's going on over there? Tell me. My, my, uh, I had a, I had a, family friend that went to New Zealand and played rugby for a while, so. I think it's a pretty cool spot, honestly. Shit up right now. Alright. We need to get some more kills. They call birds kiwis? I think kiwis are one of the coolest things ever, though. Why can't we have them in North America? Purple... And true physical damage, 3 max health of gloves. Nice. I've not heard a single player, though. America, USA, and Hawaii, top three countries? Uh, yes. It's another place I kind of forget exists. Hawaii. Dead body there. Who's creeping around these parts? Probably a warlock. Maybe a cleric. We do need cleric kills. That's where he went to. Close the door. 
Okay, I'm going this way. Oh. I think we heard him. Or something. We have 10 stacks, so maybe we can use... Maybe we can actually use Bloodstain this time. And have it... But the clerics, like, take no damage from Bloodstain. I mean, um... Dark... Whatever it's called. Dark shit. Ranger above me. Sky in this door. The cleric. Oh, fuck. Oh, he's underneath me. I need ranger kills. Back the fuck up. You guys do your fighting. I do not need warlock kills. I need ranger kills. Michael, pressure this cleric over here. This is the fight I'm more interested in. Blow corruption just killed that man. Where is he? Where is he creeping around? I know there's a cleric here somewhere. He might have went down underneath. Fuck, he probably did. Hmm. I wish I had Eldritch Shield for moments like this against a cleric and a warlock. Might be something I switch on. Not underneath. He was right here. so hard. He could be hiding around any corner, not making any noise. I don't think that's doing anything to him, but maybe. Alright. Oh, now the fighter shows up. Got a bow? That's pretty normal. Like a wind war off. Where's the health shrine when I need it? Oh. Please be a door open, thank god. Oh, that was close. I need to heal off some mobs. Any mobs here? There's one there. Get him, buddy. We can do this together. Get him. Oh, I didn't need to do this one. I want to do rave darkness. We're gonna, we're gonna, electric, we're gonna melt this man's face as well. Put pressure on him at least. Come on. Fucking throwables, dude. Never ends, does it? I just mistimed it. They come out so quickly. I want. I just need to hit him once, I think. And he dies. Yeah, he probably dies too. Fuck. Shit. It just... The little shank. The little shank is so quick. Fight a falchion there. That was perfect timing. We had this man on the ropes. That was good. Oh, wow. Oh, that's what I had. Yeah, in my inventory. He was using this. Damn, we had him. We did good there. I'm just happy we melted that warlock. I love disintegrating a, a player with Ray of Darkness. Um, what else we got going on here? All the move speed and nothing to lose. Yeah, this is this is pretty. Looks kind of feminine. You guys get that impression? Is this like robe? Maybe notice is bothering you? Okay. Okay. I got you. Um. This looks like a kind of like a nice little dress or something, doesn't it? Anyone else see what I'm seeing? Hmm. You scared of your inner woman? No. Closet milk woman? <laughs> okay, I'm not even sure what that means. Oh, man, you guys missed it. Um, I, it's laggy right now. Fuck off, Elon. But, um, I rated CS Snipes. And, uh, Wide Hip Probe. Yeah, I guess so. And Aubrey was being rate, rate annoying, like, saying bad things about me. And he asked me why she hated me so much. 
And without even really thinking, my my immediate response was because I have better milkers. You guys think that's a little over the top? Or, I mean, I showed you guys all my milkers on Pal World, and I can almost guarantee you that my milkers have better traits than hers. Uh, <laughs> so, um, but then I kind of got thinking about it, and, uh, she might, like, he didn't read it out, but people saw it. <laughs> people definitely saw it. Um, yeah, I'm just, I don't know. Maybe I shouldn't have said that. It's just kind of the, just what you guys have trained me to say. Stuff have to do with milkers, milks, and getting milked. Yeah. I blame you guys for this entirely. How close are we to armor? Probably not close at all because we need clerics and rogues. Fuck, this is taking forever. And bards. You straight shit on her boobies? Huh. I was talking about the cows. Tear this entire community apart. Yeah. Hmm. Truthfully, I don't even know anything about her milkers, so I shouldn't really be saying that. <laughs> when in doubt, blame the other person. The only thing I know is that I have nice ones. So like, maybe I'm just a little too overconfident. Don't say her milkers? Okay. <laughs> okay. Are you in a shed now? May as well be. I'm in the doghouse, that's for sure. Um, we'll just move on. We'll just move on. How about that? We can all agree that I have nice milkers on Pal World, and that's as far as I'm going. <laughs> that is as far as I'll take it. Always say that. Mm. Mixed messages here, folks. Mixed fucking messages. Mm. This thing's a beast. Anyway, I had a good laugh about it. It was like one in the morning, and... This thing feels so heavy. But like, the hip swings on this thing are intense. Come on, bring me more spiders. Oh. I'm gonna kill these little bastards now for my stack so I can melt someone with Ray of Darkness. See though, last one got, last guy we killed, it was um full stack Ray of Darkness. So I don't think Ray of Darkness is worth using unless I'm full stacked. That's my conclusion anyway. Where's this one at? One more. I don't know what I just walked into, so I'm just gonna quiet, <laughs> sit quietly in the corner. Uh, yeah. I'm not really sure what's going on either. I was just trying to be honest with the guy I raided. Maybe I took it too far. Common Zwinders are selling 100G right now. Why? Are people using them to craft? Uh, so they can do the whole, like, um, silver weapon? Nice to see you, though, Grunkle. I used to have a nice basement apartment. Your background reminds me of it. I loved it. This, the background has like, just turn the light on for a second. The background's like, there's like, over there is like insulation uh, hanging from the wall. There's like electrical shit hanging. I haven't even tried to turn the lights on since I rewired everything because I'm fucking terrified. So I have a light hooked up on, beside me to like an extension cord. Uh, I'd have to plug it in too and it, it, I'm just a little scared. I'm a little scared of the wiring. Not sure what's gonna happen. I think it's good. I, I think it's good, but... Uh, like, all these lights have had moisture in them all winter because the ceiling didn't seal properly because it got too cold. Holy fuck. Bad. Let's just say that. The oh, fuck you, didn't I? The old windmill. These, these are some crunchy skulls. Holy. Did they increase the amount of noise these things make? Seems like a lot. Like, very noisy. But maybe I just... 
I haven't walked here very often. Another rain another fighter with all these range options. Here we go, crossbow. I need to get him in the straight stretch with um melt your face off ability. There we go, this could be it. Am I gonna eat this one with bucket? It's gonna be worth it. Man, that final swing. Damn. We need to hit a headshot with our falchion there. We kill him. Yeah. Close. He was nervous. He was making popcorn in the dungeon? Exactly. We need maybe a little bit more melt, but he was going to get on top of me quick with sprint. Hmm. Interesting option in the dungeon. Everybody doesn't have weapon mastery on. Um, that was close, yeah. It wasn't bad. That's what I want to be doing with, um, with Dar Ray of Darkness, right? I want to try to force them into the blow of corruption. But, uh, I'm, I'm, like, struggling, I'm struggling with how I like to play with, like, a, like, I don't really like dagger and, like, hugging people and stabbing them. Um, I don't really enjoy that too much. I like... I like, like melee weapons that have a bit of reach, right? So I'm struggling to like try to find a way to combine the two. So if you missed it, um, that third swing, yeah, I just chopped my head off. Um, if you missed it before, we did we did a, like a few runs until we died to a creep cleric um, with just with crystal sword stacking some magic damage, and I liked it. But like everyone was saying, I'm losing so much magic damage on my spells simply because I'm not running a book or a crystal ball. It seems kind of worthless to do crystal sword only, except that my blow of corruption was hitting for like a hunt. I think it was like 70 plus magic damage. And that's with like, I want to say mediocre gear. So I'm just struggling to find some sort of like balance. Why not run some longsword? We could try some longsword. Everyone, um, longsword's a better... It is better, like, in close than most of these other options. Oh, I don't want to buy one. Too fucking cheap for that. Um, we got this beautiful one right here. We'll try some longsword. Book longsword? Maybe that's the answer. Um, maybe that's the answer that I'm, I'm looking for. Because I, I do really like the longsword swing pattern. Hard run Templar Crystal Sword locked out? Yeah. Full melee, one dagger, one two H. I was doing that for a bit. I really, I really like Crystal Sword. It's just, I, I'm kind of like when I play fighter, I'm addicted to shield slam. So I'm trying to find creative ways to make fighter fun with shield slam, or at least somewhat viable. When I play warlock, I, I'm like absolutely addicted to Ray of Darkness. So I'm trying to find a way for Ray of Darkness to be somewhat like useful, and I don't see anyone else really using it. Skill expression feels nice. Hmm. Longsword is definitely better than Zwei. One thing we should have done, I don't know if Blow, um, what's saying Blade was still up when we fought that guy either. But make sure we have that up when we're, when we're ready to engage. Have you tried Demon Form? Yeah, I did try Demon Form in, uh, Normals. Pretty intense. There's a lot of stuff in Normals that's just, like, hard to balance because it's like Slayer Fighter in Normals. It's just disgusting. You get, like, free 7 weapon damage. Um... <laughs> And then at the top end, Slayer Fighter is crazy too, but... Anything that gives you, like, just, like, a base stat increase or, like, something like that always becomes really good in normals. Like, 50 magic resist, 50 armor, and the movement speed. Click my button is gonna be pretty powerful. So. Wilson? What's going on, Fallen Phantom? What's going on? I'll just say my name. Not add anything to it. Just some magic damage should make Ray of Darkness cook. Oh yeah, it does. Yep. That's why I um. So I usually take it on helmets and pendants when I'm doing that. Oh. There's only a five stack. Oh. He's scared. What are you run into. 
He just got hit. Melt. I want to melt it, man. Excellent. I do miss the old longsword one, too. It feels so nice. Right there. That's such a... It's probably my... Probably my favorite swing in the entire game. Yeah, there's no point in me even trying to parry um, if I don't have defense mastery. I was asking Augustine about this, and he's a lot better at longsword than I am. Um, he said he would take longsword on warlock if he had defense mastery. It's the one that gives you that quick action speed on the second one, right? So, I, um, that guy's name is Rick Grimes, I think. I trust him when he says it's not good, unless you have that. Poor guy, yep. Only true is good on beam, really. Hmm. We usually take Phoenix Choker anyway, but... I thought additional wouldn't be bad. That's some Sith Lord shit? Exactly. Like, look at us. Not to mention, we get a shiny red blade kind of deal with the blow corruption. Look at that shit. That does feel kind of nice. You guys imagine... Augie knows best. Yeah, he's an amazing longsword player. I feel like Augustine's been a little um, put off by the game in the recent, like, I want to say, like, couple months. Like, before Christmas, he was really, really going hard streaming and stuff, and he's kind of taken a step back and found other fun things to do. He also got married, so that can affect just about everything you do. Nice little... Nice little noise that was. I need to heal. Oh, fuck off. Here comes a quick shot. There's our dead. Oh. We almost had him. Fuck me if I hadn't have bonked the wall. That hurt him now. Oh, oh, oh. You little shit. He felt that. Longsword, that was kind of cool, not gonna lie. Um, we could have watched it. Maybe we should have watched him die. I kind of like that. The first swing on the longsword feels kind of nice with blow corruption. Almost have enough for my PC. will be joining you in the depths soon. Fallen, oh, that's amazing. What kind of people, what are you going for? Tell me some of your parts. Tell me some of your PC parts. Not like body parts. I don't need, like, girth and length measurements. Just PC parts. You had some white bis, he was dead? True. What are we doing here, anyway? Wow. Almost 70 damage. Wait, no. 80 damage. Wilson asked about milkers again? I never ask about milkers, they just get presented to me. All the time. I don't even have to ask about them. It's my job to, to tell people how to take care of their milkers. What can I do? Can I share a link to PC? Yeah, go ahead. Actually, I'll take a look at it. I was... I'm like the type of person that's hugely addicted. When, I, like, when I'm searching for parts... Um, like, I built my my first computer to play DayZ in... Um, what just happened? What did I just hear? Scrip. Ten dollars. Thank you, man. Very, very much appreciated. Um, it's my job to tell people how to take care. It is, yeah. Uh, when I built my first computer, I think it was 20, 2013. I built my first one to play Daisy because I was playing on a laptop before that, and the laptop was like getting like 15, 20 frames in the cities. And I went super budget, AMD. I think it was the... What was that series? FX series? Um, was it FX? There was like an 8,000 or... Whatever. Um, it was the shittier version of that. Incredibly hot PC. And then I went with Ryzen again. But man, it was so fun. Learning how to build a PC and like putting all the... Not really learning how to build it, but just like... I... 
overkill things when I research stuff, like big time. Like, I go to the absolute extreme to find out every bit of information I can about 90% of the purchases I make in my life. The only impulse buying I do is for, like, Jolly Ranchers. Um, so, when it comes to putting a PC together, it's, like, probably sounds similar to what you're trying to do. Like, save some money. Um, take your time with how you want to build it. Yeah, that was how I did. I built... Any PC I've had has been one I've put together. With custom stuff. Just because of cost. Yeah. It's always usually been an AMD platform. AM4, honestly, just, like, carried me for a long time. Uh, and still, they're still putting out new chipsets for AM4. I don't even have the best one yet. Crazy. I got really lucky with choosing that. Um... It's level 57, and I just most... just... What am I, what am I reading there? Build add damage plus... Okay. Choker Pendant always cheap. Also, Choker Pendant usually rolls, um, you can get armor rating on Choker Pendant, which I think is really nice. You can get, like, 17 armor rating on Choker. Okay, I missed the message about true damage. People always have some res, yeah, so if you beam them, they can just rush at you and take min dip. Hmm. One second, I heard something. I'm gonna build some stacks. A wizard. What we got here? Oh, I hit that. But you better run. Oh, we're stuck on the spider. He was dead there. Guaranteed. Can't be doing this. This is not a good idea. See how we dodged into that? Big brain. Come on, get closer. Mind if I do? One spiders help me. Oh, they're not helping me. Oh, there they boost me that time. That was a lot of noise. Jesus. Sorry, I gotta read some some chat stuff here in a second. We're gonna kill death beetles and mimics, but we're not opening a much chest to find mimics. Not another fucking pit of doom here with spiders and shit. Spiders like boosted me. Very, very nice of them. And we're getting free stacks here again. Nice. Get rid of this guy, and we'll be feeling confident. Oh, come on, just die, dude. Die. Jesus. This won't die, man. Small amount of PvE, yeah. I'm glad this thing showed up there because it, it blocked two um two magic missiles for me. It wasn't such a bad thing. Three additional weapon damage, blue longbow. Yikes. That is a scary weapon. That's crazy. Like, if I was playing fighter. Do you know how many people I could destroy in this lobby with that bow? And it's worth like, it's like worth like a hundred gold, I'm pretty sure. I need to get the mimic kills, eventually. Hmm. Alright, that was good. Even though we don't need to kill wizards for our quest. I should loot some chests, maybe. Maybe we'll find a mimic. Long sword it is. Okay, okay. Intel is making GPUs now, and if you have an Intel graphics card, and also Intel i9 processor, the Ultra UHD onboard card will operate parallel to your Intel GPU like you have two cards. That's fucking nice. Wow. I wouldn't mind that. That's my biggest problem. Like, most of my shit is... Like, that's why I don't stream and record very often, because I don't have 
I, like my frames tank heavily because my processor just can't handle it, and because I have an AMD graphics card, the encoding on it is, isn't that good. Or I'm streaming. Maybe I could get away, but then it's like it's complicated. Like, so if I had a, if I had an Nvidia card, would have been probably smarter to do both. Stream like stream on one. The streaming is a little better. I'm streaming with the lower bit right now because of the whole Starlink shit, and I'm at 720p, kind of cap there, I think, until something changes. But I haven't gone back to 1080 since like, the second or third night I had Starlink. So I think we just used fucking blow corruption. <laughs> Dickhead. The power of the longsword. And somehow people tell me it's a bad weapon. Ow! How is it a bad weapon? It actually swings so fast. Back in the trail, you're damn right. Yep. This is when I turn into a gaming god trailer gaming. Hmm. All right. Okay. Um, knowledge. Maybe we don't need the chaperone, but... Didn't even need blow corruption. We tore that guy to pieces. Fuck. Fuck. Alright, forget what I said about Gaming God. We are still the same old Wilson. Could be using that falchion too. But we're coming into this. It's swing this like the swing speed on this is pretty pretty wild. I'm just picturing this with like a bit of dexterity. Kind of disgusting. Anyone wants to fight me, I'm just a menace now. Omega easy to parry? Okay. Hmm. I think we may have found a preferred side weapon. No. Uh, maybe it wasn't even worth. But whatever. We'll take all that junk. We killed another fighter. We're fighting a lot of fighters. No bards, no clerics, and normals. Everyone's really upset about that cleric nerf, aren't they? No one wants to enter into these caves anymore. Hmm. Who's next? Ten stacks. I kind of like this combination. Because a, a lot of players will try to push you too once you put book away. Or if they see a player with a book, it, it kind of gives them that little bit of, um... Like, it, I've done it too. Like, if I see a, a character with a book, whether it be Warlock or Wizard or whatever, Cleric, I always get the impression that now is the best time to fight him, right? You want to get into melee. So if I can time it right with Longsword and Blow Corruption... I'm like, I'm inviting the melee a little more with, um, with book out, right? So maybe this is the way to do our plate lock shenanigans. Pro of the long things, knowers, knower of shafts, yeah. Chris Dagger just killed somebody riding the wave. What is this? Of course. <coughs> This isn't gonna go very well in this room, I don't think. Nope. Fuck me. Now the pressure's on. Fuck, I missed. Alright. Okay. Uh, longsword's nice. I enjoy this. Those swings come out so much faster than everything else I was using. Nice. Wow. Um, that final swing just feels so satisfying, too. Jesus. Baiting them into thinking you're a nerd? Yeah. You're just gonna cast Curse of Pains all the time? And then you pull out the longsword, blow corruption? 
PC I'm getting isn't the best, but decent for the cost. That's 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 been all my PCs, man. <laughs> I have an I think it's a 5700X processor and then um, 6700XT uh, GPU. And honestly, I wouldn't. Oh wow. I wouldn't have bought that GPU if I wasn't um, making content for Dark and Darker because I was I was okay with what I had. Um, but I decided I wanted to get more than 60 frames while recording. So, should happen. I didn't tell the wife. You can be sure of that. <laughs> she wouldn't understand anyway. She'd have no fucking idea what I'm talking about. Uh, you did what? What do you even- it's like- it's like a different language entirely. Should I be keeping the loot? Probably not. Oh, we have a pickaxe now. I might have stuff we could actually take instead of the loot. Mm, never mind. I don't know. Invis pot, sure. Health potions. Fighting. Okay, that was another ranger. A lot of rangers tonight. Wilson's just too smart to talk to his family about computers. There's no one in my family understands any of the things I do. They really just don't get it. Like, like my father is using a phone, a camera from like 15 years ago, taking the most fucking pixelated photos in the world, and he just loves that camera. So I actually bought him. A, I bought him an unlocked phone. Like, I'm just not gonna put a SIM card in for his birthday, because. The phones actually have really good cameras for taking, um, well, just photos around the house and farm and stuff, so. Um, yeah. It's actually, it just arrived today, I just forgot to go pick it up. I want to test it out. He takes a lot of pictures of stuff, but his camera is complete dog shit, and he doesn't understand why it's dog shit, or that there's better technology out there. It's just like, well, it's just what I'm gonna use forever. Ranger had a longsword? Oh. Oh well. So, to try to explain to people that, like, have never been around technology or, like, understand technology, like, try to explain them what, what goes into, like, making a computer or what I'm doing on Twitch or what I'm doing on YouTube, it's a completely fucking different world, you know? It's not something I want to try to explain to them either. Um, yeah, nice to see you, Fallen Phantom. Will you stop in whenever? My dad... If you could imagine, like... Imagine, like, people that... Settled... Um... Like, like whether it be, um... United States or whatever, like, the, the early pioneers, you know what I mean? People that, like... Chopped down the forest and built... Like, little towns and stuff. Um, just imagine, like, super old-school methods to everything. Because that's just what you're... That's what you've always done. That's what he has the money to do, that's what he'll do. He's literally, like... He's a type of... Like, when his father farmed, he always made it, like, a goal to clear five to ten acres of land a year so they could grow more crops. And this is like clearing land by hand with like horse and then like plowing it with, you know, horses and oxen and stuff. I mean, we were like in the region, like where I'm at, my grandfather was like the first farmer to get a tractor. You know, my dad's in his uh, mid 70s. Yeah. So, yes. So this is like the mindset. Very, very old school approach um, to everything. And basically just lived off the land. Like my, when my family first got the land a few generations ago. <clears throat> Pretty close to being Hunterites. It was just like you live in the middle of nowhere, so you gotta kind of provide for yourself. There wasn't really like a town nearby, you know. Um. 
You provide it for yourself. That's just how it is. You didn't, like, you know? The the whole term an acre used to be, like, that was, that was a, an acre of land was, like, that whole measurement's, like, that's what a person could farm. Uh, like, you know, that would, would take them a day or whatever to farm that area, or, like, get hay off it. So, I did loose hay before. You guys ever do loose hay with a fucking hay fork onto a wagon? Oh, yeah. Fuck that. We used to have a barn that had loose hay in it still. Unfucking real how much work goes into that. You like bail, like a round bail? You got, I'm talking stuff that you guys probably think is a different language now, too. I just realized. So, like, square bales, tiny little square bales. You can put like 16 of them in a round bale, right? Okay. When that round bale, you can put like 2, 4, 6, 8, uh, 12 or 13 on a wagon load, if, depending on your wagon. If you're doing loose hay, that same wagon load that takes you fucking forever to fork hay onto is like one equal to like one round bale because it's like round bales and like baled hay is like packed so dense and so tight so we did loose hay on a on a field one time just i don't even know why the fuck we did it my dad used to call these things like character building um it was fucking bad it took a long time took half a wagon once there you go i follow kinda okay you guys talk, stop talking about milkers at the dinner table? Yeah. I can't say I, sh I, I talk too much milkers around my family. No. I don't even know if they would understand what I'm saying if I said milkers. I don't think they would understand that it's like a reference to what, what you guys think it is. Hmm. I grew up poor, so I worked for neighborhoods farming a little. Yeah. Yeah, I never felt like I was poor. Um... Well, looking, looking back, and I mean, I'm not like a rich person now or anything, but I have a job. Uh, I, I just seriously don't understand how my mother and father did it. Like, I have four, I have three siblings. Um, and when I was a kid, when I was first born, um, the only thing we had to heat the house was a wood stove. So... My mom and dad would light the wood stove at 5 or 6 in the morning before my older siblings would get up for school. And, uh, basically, mom would, like, sit on it while feeding me because the house was so fucking cold. Uh, yeah. Pretty crazy. We had a wood stove in our house the whole time I was a kid. And then my dad installed, like, an outdoor furnace and stuff with, um, in-floor heating and whatnot. So yeah, my room, like my room, like this, this is, this is like no word of a lie. I can guarantee you my room when I was a kid would be around 10 degrees at night. Guaranteed. fucking teed. There's a reason why we had heated blankets and I can't believe the house didn't burn down. <clears throat> the heat did not make it to my room. Uh, upstairs. There's no fucking way. So my wife was always like, how the fuck are you not cold? And I literally was- I literally was born in it. <laughs> like, it's cold. That was it. That's how I grew up. I'm gonna turn this one in because I'm tired of fucking around with these. 80 Angora goats. I fucking hate goats. Um... I hate goats. We hand sheared them with scissors- Ugh. Oh, everything you're describing just pisses me off, because I hate goats. Sheared these fuckers with scissors? Yeah. We had goats. They destroyed so many apple trees, I hated them. They're just the most conniving. They're too smart. They're too smart for an animal that can be so destructive. Oh, little bastards. Anyway. <clears throat> Moving on. <laughs> I think we could sell a falchion, right? We did get a decent pendant. Yeah, plus three additional magic damage. Not bad. Uh, the rest would probably just toss. Two, one true physical. We'll put this stuff on the marketplace. Fuck it. Yeah. Um, I don't know what... Green might be worth 70. This might be worth... 80. This is worth... 50. Alright. We'll see if that ever sells. I doubt it. 
I grew up on an island living in a community that had houses that were falling apart and had holes in them with no running water and plumbing. American dream, baby. And look at you now. Subbed to the to the milkiest of milkmans on Twitch. Excellent. Um, yeah, the 50 MR is good. Yep. And, and this is like base kit. But if I was a rich man, Zeppelin, we just discussed all the reasons why I'm not a rich man. But if I was a rich man, um, within Dark and Darker, yeah, Occultist Rub is amazing. <clears throat> More milky than whole milk, son? Probably, yeah. <clears throat> I've never really been one to care too much about, um, money, though. I feel like too many of the people my age are so, so damn focused on just, like, climbing the corporate ladder. It drives me crazy. I go to parties with my, like, my wife's friends, and it's just like, how much money do you make? Oh, did you get a raise this year? Um, well, how much time do you get off? Like, what's your pension like? And it's just like, 99% of our conversations about, like, who has the better lifestyle. It's like, I don't really give a fuck. I enjoy the shit that I have. Um, it's just like, it's so weird to me. It's so weird to me. Um, but that's just like, yeah, that's, that's what, kind of what, like, I don't know. Some people, I, under, I guess it's just what they, it's like having dreams, like I get it. It's like a motivational thing, like you want to be successful and have lots of money and do these things. I get it. Um, but... I don't really feel like I need to, like, tell, ask everyone else, or tell them what I'm getting up to all the time. Where some people just feel the need to. <clears throat> what am I looking for? Squire stuff, yes. We need to kill more rangers. I think we got the rangers one done, don't we? What the fuck am I doing here? Yeah. Rangers is done. Rogues and clerics, man. Fuck, we've been done rangers forever now. Can't find any of them. Gimmer is the best demon helm in my opinion. It gives 15 MR, really. It's expensive too, though, right? Because, um... Uh... Whatchamacallit's like it's... Barbarians. Hmm? Let's see. Additional magic damage? Holy fuck. Not a lot of them. Um... There we go. We'll go with true, true magic damage. You might find a couple. I remember I looked for armor rating on these, and it was- it was not cheap. It was not- it was like- I priced myself out of this build because of the armor rating, yeah. Like, barbarians love this shit. Those are only rares, too. Um, magic potion. Alright, we should be good. I'm really enjoying longswords, it's just- Honestly, 90% of the fights we've won have been simply because of longsword. Uh, blow corruption longsword. Probably shouldn't sell this. Fuck me. I have bangles hiding in here. I have too much stuff. Oh, I was gonna sell this bow. That's what I was gonna do. We didn't want to keep this. I'm gonna put a hundred on it. Hundred and ten. Why not? Social life for most people seems like a rat race. Yeah, I can agree with that. People that spiritually empty has to change my mind. Yeah, it's just like certain, I think like if you surround yourself with people that are like probably have similar, you're always having those conversations with like your close circle, I could see why it just turns into like a natural thing. Always got me with the back turned assholes. Who are you talking about, Captain Cuddles? D&D should make a goat man race. I missed that message, alright. Going back to some of my hate, for oh, Goblin Merchant, sorry script. We'll have to- we'll gamble after this one. Back to your trailer, you're damn right, Arrogant. You're damn right. Um, even millionaires feel a lack of purpose in life. My thing always becomes, like... I always find it really, really intriguing. Um... Like, at, at what point... Like, when you're, like, a billionaire, or like, a, even, like, a multi-millionaire... Um... What- like, when do you decide, like, you just wanna- like, you don't need any more money? Is it like 5 million, like 10 million, like 100 million? I mean, I always find that strange. It's like, I picture what I could do with like a million dollars, 
and like just like you know have my own little hobby farm or do like my own little job and retire like right now you know and and then i see people that are like multi-million billionaires like working their asses off to get more and i'm just like oh why i don't get it i don't understand i could do so much with like someone just tossed me a million dollars I would, uh, never, yeah, 500,000 even, I'd probably make it work. 100,000. I could probably find a way to make my own business. And, um, just pick away at something I enjoy. Maybe not 100,000. House this ain't cheap, and I need to build a house. My dad keeps trying to convince me to build it myself. And my wife thinks that's fucking the most absurd thing she's ever heard in her life. Dad's like, you know, uh, you can't just build it yourself. And I'm like, yep, I could. If I want to spend, like, two years building it. Oh, okay then, buddy. Fuck. He was ready for me. Kill him. I'm gonna say, he had to be close. I don't know if the first one was a headshot or not. Uh, he's getting health back. Full rush Chris Dagger. Do you guys think they'll, um... Wife would think you're pretty high if you built the house? No, she's just, she just wants it soon. That's the problem. And I can't deliver a house that quickly myself. And that's how they think they feel? Maybe over my sin. Log house? No. My dad did say that, um... Like, we, we do have a sawmill, so we could mill a lot of the lumber ourselves, but I have to get it, like, professionally approved in order to build, like, a, a dwelling. Um, I, I have had thoughts about doing, like, an excavator stream, because, not really an excavator stream, I have, like, a mini, it's not even a mini excavator, it's like a, it's like a backhoe, it's like a total backhoe, that's what it is. I gotta do some drain tile down in the orchard, so... Um, I have thought about that, which is why I might test my, the phone I bought out to be like a mobile, I'm gonna mobile hotspot with my phone and then try streaming on my, the new phone I'm getting, and if it works right, I might buy another one, and that way this spring when I do some digging around, I can show you guys my, my drain tile. <laughs> Fuck the government build a house, yeah. See, I have, I have, okay. I, when I built the barn, I, um, I'm thinking about it. I'm trying to find a way to make it work and not, like, DOS myself either. Like, give, give away too much information. So I gotta be really careful. Hmm. Um. Do is it docs or DOS? DDoS? Docs, I think. Anyway. I do want to try to find a way to share some of that stuff. It'd be pretty cool. Um. That's the shit I get busy with in the summer, so... I'm gonna test out this new phone and see how well it works. I, d I already have. I bought a mic like six months ago, like a lavalier mic, a good one. So, and I can just tow that thing wherever I want. Dude, the Esquire stream would be lit. Yeah. Oh yeah. Trust me. I've already thought about it a million times. I've thought about doing live streams um, while sharing Christmas trees too. I just don't have the data. Like a lot of my, a lot of the areas I'm working in the woods, I don't have cell service, so. Uh, I'd have to build like a solar powered, I'd have to build like a, put a battery bank on the, on the quad. Run Starlink, um, off my inverter. And then fucking get the, get the Starlink that's roaming. And have like fucking mobile Starlink on my four wheeler. <laughs> They're so crazy. <laughs> Holy fuck. Wild. I have thought about these things, but also it's not really my farm. Like I don't I don't live there, so um my father's set up and I usually spend a lot of time working with my father when I'm doing those things, so it's like I can't really just like live stream his life when he's super super like he remains hidden from everyone. He never leaves. He hates Facebook, never wants anyone ever sharing his picture, kind of thing. Um, yeah. 
What are you talking about? Must be a good old Canadian boy? Yep, perhaps. Take off a bunch of hosers. This guy. I'm going for him. Let's fuck him in particular. Let me look that way. Another, another challenger approaches. Good at him. Thank you. Crossbow. Get him centipedes. I need something to heal off of though too. Oh. Nice, perfect. Nice, look at the healing. Come on, give me more. I love the cleave on this thing. My god, it feels nice. You might be able to melt this guy. Ten stacks, man. Feels so fucking good. Oh, and that's without any gear. Slight F? Fuck. Hopefully you guys saw that one. Elon fucked me. It's- it's Meg P13. Thank you. Kind of you. Wasn't kind of gaming right now. Trailer, man. I feel so much more relaxed. Even though- even though my seating position's like really fucked right now, my toes are getting really cold. Um, like there's a lot of conversations I could, I did not want to have with you guys with my wife around simply because like I just, it's not that I don't share things with my wife. It's like it's just awkward for me. Like I, I get embarrassed super easily, especially by some of this shit. So you know what I mean? It's kind of embarrassing. I've always been embarrassed by my gaming, so the fact that I have, like, a fucking shelter from all the other shit that's going on is, like, it's so much less stress. Yeah. So, anyway, here's what it is. Scotch and soda. Nice. Alright. Goblin ears all he had for me. This guy had the loot. I need to kill a rogue. It's not gonna be a rogue, is it? It's gonna be Chris Dagger. That's moving ungodly slow, though. We'll fight him. Whatever, we're feeling it. He's moving. Jesus. We'll go back and loot this guy. Back in the trailer, yes, free pickaxe. I just see. I just saw something here. Maybe not. We'll go with that guy. More zeros means I'm better than everyone else who has less zeros. Like that was from a while ago, yeah. I did read that though. I understand what you mean. It's a race to have the most zeros. What? There is something over there. I was gonna say it might. Am I seeing things? Where did that guy's body go? Hmm. We keep killing fighters. Hopefully the F wasn't too bad. It's not really anything I control. I'm tempted to try, like, a 1080p stream again. Um. I was like, when Starling's working, like, I do have the bitrate for it, but... There's times where it hovers around, like, 4K or 4500, 4, um... Upload, and it just... Kills my. I don't know what the sweep spot is for like 90p or 900p. Maybe that's an option. I don't know. It does suck not being able to have 1080p for you guys. Is what it is. Um, magical damage reduction, physical power. Like that. 
Hunting trap. We have 112 HP. I think this is the direction he ran to, wasn't it? Oh, yeah, I didn't grab the pickaxe. My bad. Let me get some stacks. I'm starting to learn that if, if I'm going to use Ray of Darkness, I need to be using it with 10 stacks only. If we're not at 10 stacks, we need to just commit to either melee or Bolt of Darkness. Something here. I'm hearing footsteps. What the fuck am I hearing? I'm in. Come on, you know you can do it. I'm in. Come on. Just caught him with it too. We like, sliced his neck off. Little bastard, so lucky. Sliced his neck off, and he's still running. I really heard him close. Come on! Oh, I was close. Alshin, dude. You fully running? I think so. Hmm. Shit. Almost had him with that cleave. It just didn't come out quick enough. A little bit of dexterity and we kill him. Where's he gonna be creeping at? Get the bow back in now. Fuck. I'd rather go for a risky maneuver here. Do it. He's gonna hit me with an arrow. Fuck. Yeah. Damn it. Imagine with Walk having barbed door breaking. Yeah. That'd be kind of fun too, actually. Damn bows. I'm lucky. Uh, I didn't have any meds. He obviously did. Couldn't really find any mobs to heal off of either. Kind of surprised. We're fight. We're just fighting fighters tonight and rangers. No rogues. No clerics. No bards. There's one cleric we need to kill right there, and a rogue. Okay. What's this guy going? Morningstar? There's a bard? It is. Okay, there's a bard, a rogue, and a cleric in this game. We need to kill one of them before these guys kill them. Or the Slayer fighters just annihilate everyone. Maybe two clerics. Alright. Decent odds of finding a cleric. I love the dark background. It's kind of spooky, isn't it? What do you guys think? Should I keep the dark background? Like, the lighting was kind of fucking up my camera. You know? Um, oh, fuck, I just smoked my microphone. Everything's in such an awkward spot. You know? Does Ray use all stacks in the first tick of damage or no? Nah? I think it's for the duration of the... Rush Bard? I'm good. Um, I think we go back to the dark. The darkness. I specifically bought a... A camera that had a light built into it, so I didn't have to set up, um, lighting for my stream. A Razer Kiwo, Kiyo, is my camera. Can we parry that? First hit, he's already dropping poison. Little oh, bastard. I wonder if I can grab this in time. 
I love having a lot of willpower. Looks cozy. Hmm. Alright. I like this too. It's not too bright. It's not super hard on my eyes or anything. But dark is nice too. Okay. Hmm. Looks cozy. Yeah, I remember, remember not to smash this thing into the wall. Fuck. Fuck. As a player, we just died. So weird the movements we now in the first swing. Dexterity. We had a little bit of dexterity last fight. We would have won. I need to get some stacks built up. So we gotta do some slaying. Oh, my horrible frames. I don't think, though, I don't think, Nico, I don't think it does. I'm pretty sure it, it buffs the damage of the entire spell cast. So, over the duration of your, um, Ray of Darkness, your ticks hit harder each, each tick of damage does more. That's probably the Bard dead? Fuck. Oh, yeah, I gotta rush some people, don't I? I just have to, I might just have to get out of this room. Um, usually spawns, there usually there's a spawn underneath over here, I think. I feel to hear something. Oh, yes. This could be where the guy died. Could be my, my lock. It was really weird. Did you guys see me, like, miss the blow of corruption, but... He, like, walked into the blade. So, like, the sword dragged... The sword, like, dragged into him. Which I've, I don't... I didn't realize the hitbox stayed there for that long. Hopefully it's cleric. Hmm. Somebody's getting shot at. Now's our time. Where? Whoa! You scared the fuck out of me, dude. Thought you were way over there. Jesus Christ. Oh. It's a silent wizard, man. Holy fuck, okay. He's not the cleric I'm looking for. Might. Oh, I thought maybe he killed the cleric, but he didn't. Killed the goblin mage. Hmm. So was the hitbox when it was pulling back? It must, yep. Yeah. Another guy died. Hmm. Do your thing, man. I'm good. Alright, he's offering me peaceful little offerings too, and we just turn him down. Cold-blooded. Might as well tell him to go fuck himself too while I'm at it. Okay. Nothing. This is the module that usually has a player in it though. Oh yes. There are signs. Signs of battle. Alright. Yeah, I can't believe no one looted the center, though. Rogue? Oh, probably a ranger, right? Exactly what we don't want to be fighting. Fuck. Where is the cleric? Cave troll killed a guy. Oh, there's a rogue. I do need these. What if you could blow corruption and smite? Ugh, oh, disgusting. I feel like you'd need a movement speed a movement speed uh, thing now. Guess we're gonna hunt this guy, even though we're probably never gonna catch him. I really don't think taking t two skills like that is, you know, you're gonna you want phantomize or you want spells or you want sprint, something that can get you out of trouble or provide buffs for you or your team. I'm just gonna. 
aimlessly run through here and hope he attacks me because I feel like we just win maybe with blow corruption. Probably hiding in corner somewhere. Hmm. That's a great point. I'm thinking solo. Yeah. I mean, you could probably make it work. It's an absurd amount of damage. Uh, I, j I still think... Um, you're probably going to run into a barbarian with like 50% magic damage reduction. And you're going to have no movement speed. So... Depends. I mean, imagine a Slayer fighter with like sprint. Imagine that. I just sort of forgot what time it was. Holy fuck, it's like... 12.30. It's after midnight. Hey, double stacking damage, I mean... Yeah, you're probably gonna kill a lot of players. I just think... There's probably some other options that combo nicely. Give you a range of tools. He has to die to Ray. This little shanker. That was sneaky of him. I couldn't get my sword out fast enough. Hmm. I had this on, maybe. We're gonna get hit with a crossbow bolt here, but I really need this kill. Come on. This is just gonna be entire. We had to kill him with dark. We had to kill him in that one moment, or else it's just over. I might get a lucky rave on him now, but we're never catching him. Need to heal. Right, maybe this rogue will fight. I was watching Sparky do cave troll a few nights ago. Oh, we find the fucking cleric now. Of course, half HP, cornered by a rogue. We find what we come in here for. Fuck me. I need some HP. I need a mob. Oh, nice. It's crazy that I can just heal off mobs. Maybe there'll be some spiders over here. I don't really see a point of taking- Fuck, no spiders either. Mmm. Shit. Nothing here to work with. Big room still have anything left? I might have to just attack this shit up here, but... Yeah. Clerics here. Don't have Eldritch, don't have any stacks for Ray of Darkness. He's letting me get this, which is kind of nice of him. Why don't they just go full melee here with Bloodstain? Fuck it. Coming for you. Coming for you both. Oh god, we missed the overhead. Alright. Alright. Thank you. I don't know what the fuck that was, but thank you for that. Thanks. I needed both those kills, so... Uh, I'm not sure what the cleric was doing. He looked a little bit stunned. <laughs> like, very fucking stunned. I'm honest. Perfect. Revigor Chavis's. Uh, we'll just leave as well. Might be that other rogue though still around. Uh, someone just died to a Chris Dagger. Oh wait. Oh, we'll just take this. I think I have enough to get my um, Eldritch Shield off now. He just stopped. I don't understand that. 
You have spell prediction? I, I don't have the knowledge for it. I would love to use it more, but I do now. Um, we'll kill this guy. Fine, I hear the rogue. There he is again. Thing would be dead by now. All right. This guy's gonna be speedy. He switched out his pants. Oh, are you getting pushed? Oh, nice. Some shit's after him. We're gonna risk it here. See if we can get him in a bad spot. I think he's got a door to run to though. Pretty sure he's in this big room, which is gonna be a little bit tough to catch him in. We'll try though. It's pretty much the rogue playground in here. Yeah, not much I can do here. Ah, oh, shit. Rogues just have it. Just too speedy. I got those two kills though, I didn't need them both. But I saw it. Okay. This isn't good. I'm sure I like the situation I've got myself into here. I'm over it. Fuck that. Well. Goblin balls. Son of a bitch. Look how look at this. Look what he found in here. Look what this little bastard found. You think I'm ever catching him? <laughs> I saw it all happening too. I was like, oh fuck, this is a corner. Jesus, lightfoot green lightfoot's boots with three agility. And 322 move speed and, and normals, man. Four additional- Jesus! He's found some nice greens. Some very nice greens. This guy's kitted. Look at him go. I think we almost killed him too earlier. Hmm. He is- he is zooming. Dumb, boring dad. Beard ownership. What if you could- Okay, yeah, we already talked about that. <clears throat> Fastest man in normals? I think so. Oh, wait, I forgot to do, um, Goblin Gambling for a script. So we're gonna gamble. Uh, regular boots are decent. We'll do a prediction on this, too. Why not? I haven't done one of these in a while, so... If they're blue and decent gear, like, decent rolls... What do you guys think? Should it be blues, RW? Or should we base it on market? Like, greens. Greens with good roll. Because I could get rugged boots with plus 5 movement speed, and they're probably worth some money. But I can't just say blues. So, if it's a green with, like, amazing stat roll, it's a W. If it's if it's a blue, it's probably a W. Um, we'll, we'll debate it after. I'll let, I'll let you guys do the gambling, and then, or the prediction, and then I like to decide who I, I'd give the money to, basically. Yep. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Oh, wait. People... Last time in the ring, we already did this. Shit, I didn't I didn't pay you guys up for the last one. That's how scuffed a streamer I am. Shit. This is when Ryan raided me. That's all I'll blame this on. It was the agility ring, blue ring, with garbage stats. So, I think it was a W just because it was a blue. Alright. We'll do another prediction here. I apologize. I missed that one completely. Start prediction at WRL. I'll give you a minute. Maybe Ember's still around. He takes a while to do these things. Blue with at least one good roll? Okay. We'll, we'll we'll debate it after, but if it's a blue, it's very likely going to be a W. The only thing that's, like, cheap, I'm pretty sure leather leggings are... The reason why I don't like basing it on uh, the market is because leather leggings are, like, dirt cheap. But you can get a really good pair of leather leggings 
from Goblin Merchant. Like, I mean, most people wouldn't even be gambling on leather leggings. So it's kind of hard to judge, right? You don't want to be, like, shunning the leather leggings because no one's wearing them. You could still roll, like, a blue and it'd be a W in my opinion. Don't you dare fuck me with those and script needs a new pair of shoes. You've got the nicest shoes in here right now. Those, those golden six-month ones. Nice. Codus is nice double kill. That was fun. All right, we're gonna start with the leather leggings. Oh, hope I didn't see anything there. Um, I'm pretty sure prediction is done. Wow, that's not a bad start. I don't know about this one, logics. Okay, um, wow, <laughs> that was pretty good. I'm pretty sure that would be a W, right? Let me hear your thoughts. I don't know how you can say this is an L. It's only the one of the, like, plus two obviously would be, like, the perfect stat roll, but all attributes is, like, one of the best stat rolls you can get. I really, the only other thing you could probably get on these that would be amazing is just plus five or armor rating. Plus five movement speed. I'd be stepping on a leg. Oh, nice to see you, Aubrey. Um, nice to see you. Big W? Can sell for profits? Yeah, probably. I mean, we got a blue cow, too, so this, this one, would you go, okay, so if we didn't get the leather leggings, like, this is, would you guys have called this an L? I think this one was just by, by itself was just pretty shit rolls, right? No one is really taking luck, so. So, this is what I mean, this, uh, blue, I do feel like we're getting more blues from the old merchant man, uh, recently. So... Maybe, um, maybe it needs to be blue with good stat rolls as a W. We got level 31 tonight. Nice. I don't think these sell for anything, do they? I believe that cow in a chest that I found... In a, yeah, okay. We'll leave it behind. We'll check what leather leggings are worth, but they're also something I normally wear, so... I don't think all attribute leather leggings are actually worth that much. It's probably one of the cheapest... I think it's actually the cheapest pair of pants you can get in the game that have all attributes on them, yet. Yeah. 60 gold. It's, it's like, as crazy as it sounds, it's like a small W. As crazy as it sounds. Holy fuck, my whole leg has gone to sleep. I tried to move my toes and I couldn't even feel them. Oh, that's a weird feeling. Jesus. Oh, that's painful, really. It's like ice cold and cramped. Oh, that's awful, man. I'll probably trip and fall on my face as I try to go into my house tonight. That's only a small W. Look how cheap those are. Hmm. Like, th wait a second. I think it's a dub because it's all attributes, but man, leather leggings are shit. Any other pair of pants are worth, like, a ton more. So, we're going to call it a dub just because it's all at. I apologize, Logic's... You can't call it an L, yeah. Don't sleep on luck. A guy in chase chat pulled two chests stacking luck. Hmm. A W for the all ads, yeah. Basically, that's what I mean. It's hard to say, like, good, like, judge it on the market when, um, you can, like, you're, we're gambling on shit that most people wouldn't even be investing anything into just because no one's using that gear. The market's kind of funny that way. Ah, uh, manage prediction. Wow, a lot more people. A lot of people. A lot of people chose no, honestly. But it was a W. A lot of points went to no. I'm taking my points. Yeah. I personally think plus all ads don't belong. Yeah, that's an interesting one. Uh, truthfully, um. I don't know. I don't think maybe see, the, the problem becomes if like a lot of people say like you should limit it to more things right like maybe you don't put it on so many things but the problem becomes if they limit it to like one piece of gear that 
the price of that gear is just gonna be like astronomical, I think. And only certain people will have it. So like most people can get access to plus all gear now for very cheap. Where I felt like before, with like the plus three all meta, there wasn't it wasn't that kind of like accessibility, you could say. There was people playing a completely different game. Where I do feel like now you can build kits with plus plus two all on them. And they're amazing and they're really good. But it doesn't cost me a lot of money to find plus two all myself. So I'm a little intrigued by it. I, it gets a little... It gets What gets ridiculous for me, like... A little crazy for me is the people that have... Like, a, like four or five additional magic damage. Um, with like plus one all rolled on it. And, or plus two all rolled or something on this. That's when I think you start to notice, like, it gets a little bit crazy. You can stack so much additional damage now. Um, it's a bit, it's a bit wild. In combination with the plus two alls, that's when I start, when I think it starts to, like, become a little bit wild. Because the people with, like, the best gear are getting plus three, like, plus three damage on their stuff. Um... Not additional weapon damage. I want, uh, what's it called? True physical damage. What can you get? You can get it on gloves. You can get it on a lot of things. Slayer fighters use a lot of it. Um, same with additional magic damage and stuff. People are stacking magic damage with rings and then running all attribute pants and chest pieces. It becomes really, really crazy. Additional physical damage. That's what I was looking for. I think you can get like four, right? What's the highest additional physical damage you can get now? No, for a fact I saw three, but I thought you could get four. Plus, plus two all, and plus four additional damage is crazy. And then, like, conveniently, the, the things you're rolling the plus additional damage on are not the pieces you're rolling the plus two alls on. So it's actually fairly easy to get, like, your like your gloves with plus, plus additional damage, your, your pendants and your helmet with plus additional damage. And then get your plus two all chest piece, plus two all pants. Uh, get your additional damage cloak. You know? So you can, um... You can piece together a pretty high damage build fairly quickly. And then you start combining, like, the stat rolls, extra stat rolls you find on purples and blues. It's a lot of... It's a lot of stats. It's a lot of stats. Plus four additional physical? Yep. Yeah. I'm not someone that runs a lot of high, like, really, really high tier gear. Like, I don't spend... It's not often I spend more than 100 gold on a, on a piece of gear. So I don't really know what, it, what it's like to run this stuff. Or if it makes you feel, like, that godlike or not. I'm probably the wrong person to have an opinion on it. I don't run again. I don't... All I know is when I, when I see someone that has this stuff and I die, it's usually a very quick death. <laughs> it's usually a very quick death. And you're like, oh... That's why that Falchion hit so fucking hard. He had plus four additional physical damage on three pieces of gear and plus two all attributes on his chest piece and legs. Ah. You know? Yeah. But I'm not one to, I've never really fully stacked everything up. Maybe it's, um, not as crazy as I think. But. I don't know if it's just me, but I've never ran base kits so fucking much this wipe. Honestly, normals have been a ton of fun tonight. Um, despite the fact that I'm fucking freezing cold out here. Um, if I had that little heater in here, we'd be at a cozy, like, 15, I swear. Um, I don't know, if, like, you guys probably fucking can't see this. I, usually the temperature would go up. Um, and by the end of my stream in the past, even when it was, like, negatives outside or, like, minus one. I think it's, like, minus, I think it's, like, zero degrees tonight. Um, we'd usually get up to, like, 15, which wasn't bad for gaming. I kind of, honestly... Honestly, I like it better, like, 50, I like 15 degrees, like, 60 degrees Fahrenheit better than in my house, in that little room. It gets, like, 25 degrees in no time. Um, computer is not generating enough heat, no. Uh, yeah. This isn't, this isn't even the coldest I've been playing in before. <laughs> That's the crazy part. And, like, really, I, I feel comfortable, it's just my toes. It's just my toes. Um, I'm just wearing, like, a light sweater and a t-shirt. It's the chest, it's the, I have a sweater underneath. You can see some of it. I literally have a sweater underneath the shirt. 
So, that does help. Oh, yeah, my toes are fucked. But I gotta get going, folks. Um, I appreciate you all. This was a fun one. I did not think I'd be streaming this long tonight, considering I'm out here in the fucking cold. Um, you said Fahrenheit. Did you mean Celsius? Uh, it's 10 degrees Celsius, 50 degrees Fahrenheit. When I'm... When I was in my house, like, it was like, felt like it was 25 in there. And it felt way too fucking hot. So, I actually like... When I was out here streaming before and I had the little heater, 15 degrees was perfect. 15 degrees Celsius. For, for me, and comfortably gaming. I also, my wife always tells, tells me I'm like a heater. Because, like, my heart, I feel like I'm just like, I, my body just knows how to generate heat. I'm all, I always run hot. Always. Like, I'm very, very hot individual. Um, I don't know if anyone else ever feels that way, but, like, that is what, I can, I can never stay cold enough. It's crazy. Obviously, I can in Canadian winters, but in the summer, I fucking hate it. Yeah, <laughs> goodbye 10k, yeah. It's probably all the shafts. Hmm. Uh, what? I'm not... I don't really do anything with shafts other than handle them from time to time. Other than, other than handle them and observe them and admire them. Hmm. Thanks for the stream, Takoda. Yeah, no problem, man. Thank you guys all for being here. We're up to 60 people, mostly thanks to Ryan. Um, huge shout out to Ryan, six days a week. One of the worst guys in the Dark and Darker community. But some reason, he loves in invading my channel with his, his toxic garbage. Crazy. Crazy. But follow him if you dare. You know? <laughs> Well, um, he's fun. I hope they did the podcast tonight. I'm interested to watch that tomorrow. I have another day of meetings tomorrow, and then Wednesday is supposed to be my normal stream day. So hopefully I figure out the heating situation. A whole bunch of snow is coming. Um, I have a leak in the roof, so I'm a little concerned that water may get on things. I have to be cautious of that tomorrow and monitor it. Uh, professional shaft handler, yep. Yep. I handled a few shafts. Um, what else? What else for tomorrow? Nothing else. Hopefully, I'll probably try to go live tomorrow if it's not too stormy. Um, we'll do the first storm trailer stream. But, um, fix your trailer. Yeah, okay. Buy some snacks. It's almost one o'clock. Fuck. So late. Um, I might just have to go. It's so late. And I gotta shower and stuff and get ready and I gotta get up at 6 a.m. Bye, everybody. Thank you all so much. Enjoy your shafts and use them wisely. That's all I'm going to say. Bye, everyone. Thank you so much.